right? What's going on? Look, I'm looking at the stars. How's it going, everyone, as I fuck around with this damn thing? My screen's up top. I got multiple monitors. I'm big, big, big game hunter now, guys. How's it going? It's true. I saw you hunt a big game. It was a rabbit. It was great. It was. It was a rabbit. I fucking butchered that rabbit from a mile away. Shot in the eye. Another drink? Why don't I? Kind of hitting it hard. I did uh, two shots prior with my boy Grusey. That was good. Can never argue with that, you know? So, but we don't count those shots. Let's make it three. <laughs> well, I can't count those ones, but let's make it three anyway. Better click this button real quick. Hold up. Twitch chat would bug me forever if I didn't. It's my 16th birthday. Oh, yeah. That was good. Cheers. Hmm. Ah. Anyway, I'm going to go shuffle this name down until it's relevant again, but I'm just so mad about that movie still. <laughs> we'll go over the movie soon. We'll go over the movie soon. I couldn't even write a summary of it, Tool. What are you going to write? It's a series of just fucking slapstick noises. Did anyone get the France vibe from that? Like did th it was not only did it have like like I felt like a very French theme like a romance theme through the whole movie, even played French music like some style. Anyone else get that vibe? We'll talk about it later. We'll talk about that later. Yeah, we'll let's talk hold about it. Let's it let's hold it. I just I, I, I said I said it before the stream started. That movie turned me into the Joker about halfway through, and I started like I gave so little of a shit after a point. <laughs> I know I did too. I started watching it last night, and I was just like, this is fucking brutal. I would I would sooner watch um what other shit Quigley's Down Under where it's a repeat of the fucking I would right. no but the whole movie is them just riding horses across the countryside that would have given me more entertaining all the Land Before <laughs> Times uh, I actually like Land Before Time too if I remember correctly that one was the best only two only two two was the best one Chomper was the boy monk we all live in a society yeah we do live in a society. How's Joy Six Audio, guys? We did do a big uh, audio overhaul since uh, round a, one, so I'll just make sure everything's. So, there was a there was a bug in OBS that's not documented, and I made sure it doesn't stay documented that well, so by not documenting it further. Uh, but I found the bug <laughs> and I fixed it myself. I know how to not have it happen. Is it being recorded? I double checked that beforehand, but let's triple check it just to be sure. Uh, Am uh, I being recorded? You Am are I being audible? recorded. Yeah, you're audible. You're audible. Okay, that's good. The alerts don't though. I make sure the alerts don't get recorded. Yeah, because copy fix. copy strikes yeah. pieces of shit even uh i have nostalgia for that because i think uh grandma said some DV dvds vhs for life for those ones dvds looking for those crystal things Child. that was well before my time or after my time mine was the one they went to the new the the, the promised land and then they did the, the they had chomper because they went out and found a mini t-rex and brought it back and he just likes to eat things was great they like okay things i know about dinosaurs from that movie they fucking love leaves that are shaped like stars uh t-rex scary doesn't talk no chomper was All tiny so chomper must have came back chomper, chomper was a little was baby in the beginning yeah, wasn't yeah. chomper a little later oh yeah littlefoot's mom dies in the beginning yeah no chomper yeah, was a baby in number two and i already comes back as an adult but like what is, how fucked up is it that the t-rexes are like the dinosaur that can't speak didn't didn't uh, the little Iggy thingy, the little fucking thingy, didn't that uh, yeah, didn't that didn't that voice actress die after Land Before Time too? And she was a child too. I donh, don't know. I think she was murdered. I think her dad did it. I'm not even lying about that. I'm pretty sure that's right. Maybe it was Ducky. Maybe it was Ducky. Yeah, yeah, she dead. <laughs> she dead. What's going on, the guest? I think her you father know, murdered her or something, right? They named ducks after that dinosaur. They did. Yeah, because the dinosaur came first. Yeah, obviously. Well, I always come first. Yeah. But, then some. Okay, then you, some. <laughs> then, then dinosaurs. Me. Then dinosaurs. Then ducks. <laughs> then the ducks. Sometimes in that order. Sometimes all together. It's like a those turduckins, but with cum. Yeah. Um. Yay. <laughs> yay. <laughs> if he can come. <laughs> oh, what a what a fa family friendly stream. Going on. It's always a family-friendly stream around these parts. Mm-hmm. Opening dialogue. Aren't birds just yeah. dinosaurs or some shit like that? Y'all, the it was isn't the um 
What was that Velociraptor? Isn't that really just a fucking feather brain bastard? Yeah, I mean they all like the the smaller dinosaurs were it's like by my remember if I remember right. Fuck right. I don't know. But like the dinosaurs that survived were like the smaller ones and then those ones became birds, I believe. They flew they away from birds. Yeah, they flew away from the smoke when they went extinct. Yeah, they, they That's what happened. The meteor. They went the to meteor. space, yeah, they went to space they and came back. Came back. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. They pulled an umbrella academy or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got that lots to yeah, That's yeah, where yeah. they got the idea, actually. Yeah, yeah. They, they had to make room for the Nazis up there, though. They all came down January 6th, though. I am... I'm scooting further and further right. I don't Why? Know what's, going what's going on? Oh, I need to be scooted further right. That was my yeah. problem. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going further and further left. Oops. Fucking hell. Well, yeah. How's it going, everybody? Hey, yeah, buddy. Mm-hmm. It's been a it's been a busy week, and and week before, we've had uh, so many things. We did so many <laughs> things, so back to back. We had the round one of the tournament, the March Madness tournament, not the other one. Stay tuned for that. Uh, and then we did uh, D and D on Sunday. And then we did show today. Then we have round two on Wednesday. It and stop. rain doesn't stop. I'm making, uh, is he quiet? He's probably, I just turned him up. What there should we. I, do you want me to get in here like this? No, I just turned you up. Thank you. There Thank you, go. Tequila. I worked hard on it. I played hard on it. <laughs> yeah, that was true. I totally played hard on it. Uh, although I was thought we were going to fight some things more at the end. We didn't. I was, I was like, okay, but I want to try out my new, uh, three, three D, D six sneak attack action. Didn't get a chance, unfortunately. Didn't get a chance. Yeah. I had to make sure I needed to make sure that the server wasn't gonna explode while we were running that. So I no, didn't you gotta stress test it. Stress I test didn't it. over I didn't over test it, yeah. Because it's the first time I've run it with um because I've been doing like narrative heavy games on it for now. Like there's right. not like tokens you're moving around and right, right. special effects. That's why I went overboard with like the stupid lights and shit. Well dude, visual. Wanted... That's that's how stream it looks better on stream. I will say ours look better than all the D and D's I saw on Twitch. Because they do the they do the fantasy of the mind thing, which is fine for playing the game. But I think a nice visual effect on stream is the best. You gotta see something, right? Because if we're all gonna imagine it differently, and we're not reading a fucking book. We need shiny boys. You need to see those dice rolling. <laughs> we do gotta fix my effect. I want those crits to just shatter the fucking screen. Yeah, I'll fix that. Yeah, I think I know to... what's up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but uh. What was it? So we got that, then we got round two. And today I was working on making my own Mugen character! I saw. You saw that, right? Just gonna be a pain in my ass for a bit. I had to find 400 fucking sprites. 400! You might be able to redo, like... I'm gonna redo a bunch of them over and over yeah, to you can... duplicate. But still, it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Oh, yeah. That, that the software used is also horse shit. Yeah. Fighter Studio is not good. No, it's not. It's not good at all. But I'm going to do why it. why I gave up after editing the life bars a little bit. <laughs> I was like, nope, no more. It's just you can't you can't uh, scale. There's no scaling. Mm -hmm. You can nope. move, but you got to find out the exact dimension of the fucking thing. Yep. And then and then put it in there straight off the bat, which I got to once I figure that out, it'll be easy because it's the same across the board. But yeah. Well then, and then you get into the sloppy nonsense of you need to make sure those hitboxes line up right. No, I don't. Or you don't. I guess <laughs> no, I that's don't. true. I mean, they other people don't give a fuck. <laughs> I know. Logically, if I'm in the rough zone of the thing that I'm putting it on, it's going to be close enough. And it's not like that'd be one thing if the players are fighting it, but the mm -hmm. AI knows the hitboxes. Oh, and then you have to re-record your voice lines. That will be fun. That, 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 that will be fun. <laughs> seems like it should be fun, but it's actually kind of also a pain in the ass. Oh, <laughs> At no, least, if you're bolting it onto a character that already exists, you don't have to give it, like, voice ID numbers. Right, right, yeah, I'm, I'm using uh, I'm using their ID numbers already. Yeah, so you So then, then I'm just gonna it. take, yeah, record over, and instead of speaking in Portuguese or, or Spanish, it's, it's, it's gonna be limp dick! That's it's just gonna, gonna be limp dick, every line. Gonna, every line. Limp dick. Tool, <laughs> tool machadukin? <laughs> <laughs> Yes. <laughs> What's up, Sean? How you doing, brother? How's everyone doing? Ah, uh, my drink count's wrong. I that tried to sucks. breathe my drink, and that felt bad. 
Kind of weird. Gift bot's not working. Is being a piece of shit. Just get something to replace gift bot. Gift bot is overstayed their welcome, apparently. Uh. Oh, I see. It didn't actually load properly. Uh, yeah, I kind of actually have a way to change Giftbot a bit. I just kind of lazy. I could use Lurenbird to do it instead. Lurenbird. Lurenbird. But I'm just it, that, <laughs> that will take a huge overhaul, and I'm just not ready for that yet. Yeah, no there, one wants to work. Back. I get you. Yeah. Well, I'm already doing all the other editing. You gonna have a good drink though? Fuck yeah! I'm gonna make a good drink today too. We got a lot of good drinks today. Gotta get that. Agave spiked seltzer. Yeah, I'm on three now, right? Yeah, I'm on three because I had the drink on stream. We only count on stream. Oh, no, I'm at four. I count the starting soon screen. So I had two of these. No, three is right. Yeah, three is right because I had a shot and then two of these boys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we got some t uh, information for what's coming up. Um, mm -hmm. What's going on, Dewey? We got... Um, Let's just talk about what's going on there. We got we got the movie reviews. We might even get yep. to the Superman topic we've been wanting to talk about for at least a month and a half now. Nah. <laughs> right? We're probably not going to get to it. We never seem to. We got a couple fuck yous. There's a lot of fuck yous today. But they're not all fuck you fuck yous. But there's some good fuck yous today. Uh, the last one is a fuck you, but I'm not putting in the fuck you. We're going to talk about an absolute shitty movie. What's going on, Tessa? We're going to talk about Barfy. We're going to roll for or spin a wheel for a better fucking movie. I'm um, still so conflicted about Barfy. <laughs> we got, we got uh, open bet mode, which is just we're not going to tier. We're just going to say all anyone's in, and we're going to play a couple of those rounds. We have DC versus Marvel. We got that coming up soon too. Made that today. There was one character I wanted to find, but I couldn't find it. So there's a guy named Spider Man, right? Uh huh. There's I don't, a guy I, named who's this guy? So this is superhero Spider Man. Oh wait, no. Okay, is that you, like um? Is that yeah. like a yeah yeah yeah, like Mr. Marvel? What? Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> fuck you. So you got Spider Man, and then you have Spider Space Man, mm -hmm. with the, the 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 space bar. Two different words. Yeah. Yeah, two different words. Who's a villain and looks like a furry arachnid? I just couldn't find yep. a lot of info on that guy, but he looked Did fucking you ever find ridiculous. Spiders Man. No, <laughs> that one seemed funnier. It's a bunch of uh, sentient spiders in a suit. It's very good. Oh, for fuck's sake. Wow, what movie you send me the oh, other Spider day? Oh, Spider-Man gets so stupid <laughs> with alternate realities. Um, Now I gotta look to see what he sent me. I don't remember him sending me a movie. Oh, he did. Dead con. I gotta send it. It is on Netflix. Movie. I need to redeem myself. All right, let me add that quickly. Let me add Dead Con. I'll add it to the spinny, spinny wheel there, Monk. Thank you. I just didn't see that before. It's so easy to add this shit to here. So there we go. We got we added Dead Con to the movie roster. I just keep wanting to talk about Barfy because I want to yell about it. But do you want to no, just go we... to Do you want to go to Barfy already? We can. It seems like it's too early. I agree. But boy, howdy, do I have words to say about Barfy when we talk about it? And you, you just mentioned you did it again, this. and it brought it all up. You did I this did. to us. You. I did. This isn't me. This is you. I, w I looked up Whatever a movie camera, that I would have never watched, and it was re rated pretty well on Rotten Tomatoes. <laughs> let's get Murphy Oops. out of the way. All right, let's get Murphy out of the way. Fuck it. Let's talk about Barfy. Fucking this movie. The movie is called Barfy. The character was named Murphy, but he couldn't speak properly. He can't so say his own name. So know, he says he, his name he is has, Barfy. He's, not a, he's, like, he's mute, essentially. So we can hear Yeah. But he uses sign language, but people in India don't know sign no, language. No, he can't hear. He, he's deaf. He is? Yeah. They make up a couple of scenes in there where, like, they cut to his perspective and there's no sound. But he's reacting to sound! Yeah, that's just bad acting tool. Okay, never mind then. Never mind. I thought he was, I thought he was just mute and not deaf, because he's, he's literally reacting to sound. No, and that's also why, I mean, uh, I, it's at the end why the other girl had to say that the autistic lady was yelling for him because he couldn't hear her it's a whole thing dude this movie is a whole makes more thing. sense it is all right let's you you are i'm gonna leave joystick i don't have since it's his I movie for this. i don't give a shit you tell me what the movie's about fuck okay <laughs> this is your okay fault. i thought about this hard i thought all about this long and hard um okay so a long time ago okay at the start of the movie barfy dies but he doesn't die it's fine after that he's born <laughs> and his mother dies shortly after childbirth so he's raised right. by his dad alone he's got hearing issues he was named after a radio called a murphy radio 
and then apparently because he can't speak well because he's this takes place deaf. in the 60s or 70s i can't remember one of those i think 60s. yeah 70s 70s pops up a lot like oh, yeah, as 70s. far as has him being old enough to hit on women so that's, okay um, 70s then probably born in the 50s uh so he's a he's a deaf mute guy and he is mr bean he like he, do, he does things without any sense all the time uh, just constantly he's just it makes no fucking sense it's like this movie is like what if we wanted to take mr bean very seriously <laughs> oh my god okay so he finds yep okay he, he's like 18 now he still he still hasn't learned how to write he'll learn later it'll be fine um but he, he f discovers this lady who he stalks obsessively he ruins the city time without cell phones he changes a clock tower to mm -hmm. impress this lady yep which screws up everyone's day probably got people fired selfish prick yeah pro uh, hopefully hopefully uh so he is really into this nice lady but she's trying to pretend like she's getting married. So well, he's like, was, oh, no, she, my heart. Uh, uh. She, she was getting married. Yeah, uh, well, she was, <laughs> and then she wasn't, and then she super was, and then she super was she didn't. That's irrelevant. <laughs> Time goes on. The, like, like the clock hands that got pushed backwards. And Barfy <laughs> uh, is reacquainted with his... Somebody he knew as a child, because he's dad is a worker at an estate and this the lady grandfather died grandfather died so this girl who's autistic who's grown up now uh is inherited the fortune essentially and uh, the trust barfy met the, the trust yes barfy's reacquainted with her and they kind of like they just have a i mean barfy's like a grade material hang out with somebody who's autistic apparently like I, <laughs> yeah, there's no other way i can say it like they, they both vibe uh and you know that's kind of cool um oh anyway, you, got, they, you missed out how barfy nearly gets murdered by the police not when he gets yeah, arrested because he robs a bank no no before that uh, in the beginning of the movie, he's running across a bridge on top of a building, and the cops just yank the bridge out from him, letting yep. him fall four stories. Luckily, that, there were boxes there. Tool, that was at the beginning of the movie, but it takes place like three quarters of the way through the movie, which it, I, you know, I don't, I don't <laughs> feel bad that you might not have put that together because this movie is. I did because he's jumping long. back and forth, but it happened in the beginning, so you know the cops As are the murderers. Heat death of the universe. The movie is two um, and a half hours long, and it even has an intermission. Keep this in mind. It has a built-in intermission. Watched it at one and a half speed. <laughs> and That's it was cheating. Still too long. It was still too long. You're cheating. Oh my I god. I watch it at one speed. You bitch. Well, some of those things were extremely slow, and then sometimes I had to turn it down because, like, as soon as Barfy started getting antsy or <laughs> crazy, yeah. suddenly everything was going way too fast. Sometimes it's okay to watch movies that are in other languages. Cheese, man. Get some culture. Yeah, alien movies aren't gonna be in it. Yeah, Barfy is terrible. We don't ever watch that shit. Okay, so keep going. I want to hear it. All right. Fuck. <laughs> <here>. Fuck. <laughs> I'm just still having struggling here. <laughs> okay, so it's his two love interests are a very pretty lady and this autistic lady who's fine probably, but she is autistic. Uh, and through circumstance, Barfy decides that by cutting down a lamp post, he's in love with this autistic lady. And they get married, and that's cool, I guess. There's a reason. Then, you said the reason why it's a good line, and it slightly makes sense in a sad, dumb way. Oh, the the part where, like, the first time he did it with the other, the pretty lady, she, like, ran away from the thing because she was scared. Yeah, and he wouldn't the lady wasn't. die together. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that, anyway. That's romantic, you prick. It's romantic, I guess. Whatever. So, they get t together. Barfy, autistic lady. Meanwhile, pretty lady who has been married now and is like, I'm in a loveless marriage. Fuck this. Comes back to Barfy and is devastated. Because now, he loves her. He loves autistic yeah. girls so much. And she uh -huh. misses that. She wanted yeah. that. Also, sometime before that, there was a bank robbery. <laughs> Which also made <laughs> no goddamn played for, sense. Played for laughs. Um, and, and then a ransom note. Uh, 
Also, he kidnapped the autistic girl. I, this is that part of the part of the movie. I was just like, I don't understand why this exists. Why are we doing this? Well, she was lonely well, up in her why room. Is he the well, police guy and the police guy is like, this man tried to rob a bank. Oh, he didn't try. He him. did it. Uh, and like, Remember the police cool, guy guess. used to wear 52 size pants. He's down to 42 after this shit. He know, definitely did ruins. not look 42. He was a 48 easy. Just uh, saying. Okay, so in the end, Barfy, like there's like a, a, a brief moment. The, the autistic lady goes missing and Barfy's devastated and pretty well, lady comes in. She only speak. went missing because he was so busy fixated on the pretty lady at this point. Yes, true. And then that's what made him realize how much he really, truly loved Autistic Lady. Uh, and long story short, like, they're reunited and it's I, they have get married. And that's the end of the movie. His name was Murphy, though. Yeah, and it was mind-numbingly long. Now, now keep in mind, most of, this, most of the scenes is, is... I got very French vibes from this. French music, French, like, styles of... Uh, well, Barfy acts... Like it's a French romance film. He uh somehow Barfy's made it to this point in his life. He doesn't know how to read. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> I'm saying so. He does this. The whole movie though is scenes without any dialogue, really. Well, it's because he can't of, talk. Well, in general, no one's fucking talking. Even when he's with the pretty lady, where they're like bumping <laughs> shit. You hear fucking like Charlie Chaplin, fucking um. Uh, like sound effects, which actually there's a scene in the beginning where you see Charlie Chaplin uh, cut out of him standing there. Perfect. That was in the beginning. So I was like, oh, it's going to be a Charlie Chaplin film. Like, this is what we're going for. And that's pretty much all the comedy of, of, of Barfy was. He'd fall over, he'd evade Very cops, action. almost yeah. like Charlie Chaplin. In fact, that's when like... they cut the frames, it was pretty much reminiscent of old style comedies from that era. Yeah, like so, he's holding onto the side of a bus being pulled at like 30 miles an hour and he crashes into a sign and that's for laughs. His bike is destroyed. Yeah. <laughs> his bones, I assume, also. No, his bones are fine. Adamant. Oh, yeah, he, he bounces. It's fine. But it has this undertone where the pretty lady is talking about her or him and saying he would give her a picture like right before he dies or some bullshit. So he quickly does it with his nice Canon camera. <laughs> While he's combing himself, he takes a picture, which he does throughout the whole movie. He combs his hair. Yeah, he loves to comb his hair. He loves to comb also, his fucking hair. Also, when it's around the bank heist time, he has a friend who isn't there at any other point, and I have right? no idea who this fucker was. I think it was his father's friend. Oh, uh, daddy's friend. Daddy's mm. friend, yeah. Yeah. There's. It was just a series of events that they kind of went together, but were, like, unnecessary. Like Quigley Down Under, remember? This movie. They could have. It's like Quigley Down Under. Remember that fucking movie where I said half the movie they're just riding horses around the hillside? At least yeah, that had I a little like bit more, more context. <laughs> this was that just Quigley I, at no point decided to like start like doing slapstick comedy in the middle of the movie. Well, I think the reason this got a huge score is because I think it was trying to emulate old comedy slapstick from from the golden age. And all those fucking pretentious pricks were like, look at this. Ha ha ha. This is amazing. I know about the miracle worker thing. I get it. It was wah wah, I thought. Wah wah. Anyway, I know people who are deaf who can read just fine because you pick up context. But he was too busy goofing around, cutting down life posts. Which also, let's talk about how he does not give a it's shit a about destroying community infrastructure. Oh yeah, loves it. He just Can't fucking enough. does it. Turns off the fucking clocks every way, breaks shit. Let's also talk about everyone hates the autistic girl when she's singing. They also just start making fun of her and pointing and laughing. And then let's also talk about how the fact that pretty lady's mom, who scolded her into marrying for money, is out cheating with the fucking original love interest of hers the whole fucking time. And nothing came of that conversation. She's like, you lied to me. You're, you're still seeing him. You love him. And it's like, yeah. yep. And then nothing. That's nothing. it. Nothing brought up again about it. Just done. Yep, you're right. You're fucking right. You got me there. Man. Fucking movie. Man. I was so disappointed. <laughs> you were disappointed. You watched it at 1.5 speed. I watched it all today, and it was miserable as shit. Oh, my God. Like, I'm down for, like, Bollywood nonsense, right? Like, right. I, I love me a weird singing thing. I love me some weird action scenes that make no fucking sense. 
This right. movie just... <laughs> it tries so hard to be like, you need to care about these people. But you don't. But I couldn't bring myself to do it because they kept doing like... <laughs> well, I think also... When, I, when Lucy asked me about this movie earlier, she said the line... Um, what did she say? Let me let me scroll up and see what she said. She said the line. Did Beast didn't even watch the movie? I don't no, want to hear he any feedback no, he from no. somebody who didn't even watch <laughs> the no movie. No fucking shit. Oh, wait, I was going to try, try and cram Barfy in it. Did you hate it? And I said, not more than myself. I take that statement back. <laughs> I, <laughs> a lot more. <laughs> After finishing it. My God. And that then movie they, was so all over the place. They went to that lower frame rate to make it seem faster film, because that's how they sped up film back in the day. By just <sighs> lowering the fucking frame rate. Which you could tell they did. And also, the the fat cop has the ability to teleport. Yep. He has, he has teleportation powers. He's able to get in front of Barfy, who's running at full speed, sometimes on a rail of a train, and somehow the cop's in front of him. Uh, also... Okay, so the cops are chasing this guy, and they didn't make it a... If a real person... Okay, as much as the movie wants you to take it deadly seriously with everything it does, if anyone did with that shit that Barbie does at the beginning of that when he's running from the cops, they'd go to prison forever. <laughs> like, yeah, instead they're like, hey, now it's your turn to beat him. Beat him while I talk to this lady. <laughs> <laughs> but they don't give him any prison sentence, so I guess that balances out. Fucking hell. I don't know. I hate this movie. <laughs> I really fucking hate this movie. I hate this Ugh. movie so goddamn much. I hated the movie the whole time. <laughs> I hate it after. I'm so happy. <laughs> I fucking hate this movie. I thought Quigley was the peak of like this was dumb. I like no. Quigley. Barfy is ass. Barfy is absolute <laughs> shit. <laughs> like get the fuck out of here, man. So. Uh, these we live in a society. We live in a society, guys. <laughs> there. I gotta clean these, actually. Um, I had fun with. I just thought Quigley had too much filler scenes of running through the fucking on their horseback. It just was long, and then some characters were forgiven too easily. Yeah. I will say this. Yeah. About Barfy, I bet if somebody were to make a cut of this movie that was like an hour and twenty minutes long instead, it would have been a pretty okay movie. What's with the cigarettes thing? Cigarettes kills. Cigarettes kills? Did you guys get that. those in the beginning? It kept saying cigarettes kill people. It was like oh, an ad. It was like yeah. an ad. And in the year intermission, it said right. it too. The beginning, even though I was watching it at enhanced speed, was like five years ago. Um, so a, it okay. said cigarette, like a little ad saying cig smoking cigarettes will kill you. And then in the intermission, it said the same thing. Yeah. Would you consider this the worst in the Soggy Rag movie? Well, the Soggy Rag movie hasn't been made yet, and it's going to be the best film ever. So it's suck it's it. going to be a bunch of these shows stitched together. Stitch together. Yeah, <laughs> uh, random cutscenes, but with different frame rates, because then oh, it'll yeah, be yeah. yeah, of course. Can I fall off a bridge into an alleyway? Oh, yeah. All right, let's fucking go to the watch list, boys. And we all know the watch list is the movie that we're going to watch next week. All right, we watch up until oh, next week. So let's get the wheel going. We still got quite a few movies on here. A lot of them by Monk, some of them by me. We got some other people in here, too. Um, and uh, I did add Dead Con, which Monk asked me to add. Over oh, the Tool McBag cut. You know that will be the best cut. Oh, shit! It went over to The Grudge. The Grudge is actually a good movie. I like The Grudge. Are you going to watch Juan, too, just to get a comparative? Maybe. <laughs> this is one my wife will actually watch with me though. This so is a good. This is a good movie. This is a good movie. I like The Grudge. I'm excited. Mm -hmm. This is by uh, Tessa. Submitted this one. Um, the Grudge is a good one. The Grudge, Grudge is one of my favorite horror movies. Even though it has fucking Buffy in it, it's fine. Uh, Juwan's good too. I actually think Grudge Two, Juwan original is great. Juwan mm -hmm. Two is meh, right? I guess Grudge Two is amazing. Did they uh, ever yeah. reboot The Grudge? Is there a newer Grudge than The Grudge? I feel like... Uh, yeah, they redid The Grudge, and it had the guy from uh, Star Trek in it, as well oh, okay. as uh, Kumar, yeah, yeah, yeah. White Castle thing. I think he's in I it. Knew, I knew this. I yeah, knew, I... and it was, it was absolute shit. 
So now I need to go watch three of them, I think, is the problem. You no, know, four, because there's Grudge 1 through 3, then they rebooted. Well, no, I'm not going to watch all the Grudges. I'm going to watch all the remakes of the Grudge. <laughs> oh, boy. Exactly. And it's not, why are there so few good ones? Well, good is also perspective piece. Actually, I think the Grudge is a good movie. So, you know, suck yeah, it. Yeah, it's, it's about talking about it. It's yeah, about and, having... And, 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 and also, actually, when was the last time I saw The Grudge? Like, yeah, a long fucking eight time years ago, ago? So, and then let's look at here. 75, 7,500. 7, Don't know what that's about. It could be a good movie. That, that, uh, the IRA movie was surprisingly fucking good. Like, that one was good. We never watched The Grudge, well, we cheese, watched man. The we grudge. watched The we watched Ring. The Ring. The Ring is different. Yeah. Basically the same movie. Yeah, it's different. Wagons East is probably shit. Get Duke's probably shit. 71 might be good. Saving Mr. Banks. No idea what that is. Oh, man. I can't wait to land on Midsommar. <laughs> All right, Midsummer's on there. That's right. Midsummer's right there. Midsummer uh, fucked me up in the theaters. It follows is really good. It did, yeah. You didn't think it was going to be good, but it is. Didn't Rudge and Gring have a crossover? No, it didn't. Not at all. Why would it have a crossover? They're two different entities altogether. In fact, yeah, it's not yeah. like Freddy and Jason. Yeah. Wagons East was was it really? Oh well, that could be good then. So it's a comedy. But yeah, so I mean, we put movies that are on Netflix or Amazon Prime because it's more available for everyone else, and then they watch them, mm -hmm. and we're like, hey, sometimes it could be great, sometimes it will be shit. We're learning. We're watching <laughs> things. Again, I was not... That IRA movie, it started out really slow, and I was like, okay, what's this going to be? I ended up really liking the fucking movie. IRA movie was pretty good. Right. And it came out of nowhere. Also, it made me think about a thing that I don't think about ever, which uh, that whole situation was fucked up. Oh yeah, that situation was was it was very bad. No, no yeah. one understands. It was just car bombs here and there. Yeah, it, it was. It was. It, there was some. There was some action going on. Reason that people don't like the drink being called that. It turns out. Yeah. <laughs> um, Sadako versus Kayako. If it's not an official fucking movie, then it's not really much of a crossover, is it? If they didn't get the rights to either side. Let's see here. So the, the, the film was first he's April Fool's joke. Man, I'm pretty sure all of the, the ones that are called The Grudge are the American version. Yeah. Yeah. Zhuan's the Japanese one. Yeah. Uh, da, da, Not da, da, like da. The Ring, which was literally just Japanese The Ring. We just get to be cheeky and call it Ringu. Yeah. Not canon. Not a good movie. I mean, it was on Shudder. If it's on Shudder, it can oh, get yeah, the fuck out of here. That. Yeah, so that Shudder. doesn't count. Now, Freddy vs. Jason does count because those are canon. And those are part of it. Some people just making movies and just be like, hey, it's this. Doesn't count for shit. Do you that's, think like, Freddy that's like calling, uh, what is it, Friday the 13th? I think number 13? Or maybe it's 11. Maybe it's 12. Did, you're, it's the did one Freddy that, and Jason the ever candy. fight the Predator? No, I feel like there, they're the there, same is, there is one called uh, Freddy fought Ash. And oh, Chase from Pokemon. And no, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, from Pokemon. <laughs> they did uh, from um, there's one where Freddy, dead, yeah. Freddy caught yeah, Ash and uh, Jason, and they're all like dueling it out. But it was like a, a budget of like six thousand dollars and they right. made the fucking movie. And it, it's I won't even watch that because I just cannot be bothered. I don't know how you shoot a movie for six thousand dollars because like I've been looking at buying a camera. <laughs> it is a comic, but watch the movie. The movie was made with nothing. Uh which I think is called Oh like, my god. Yeah, it was made in 2011. Look at that. Look at that. They need like okay, if you have Ash, if you have a guy named Ash in it, and you don't have mm. Bruce fucking Campbell, it's not Ash. It's just not fucking Ash. We should throw in the Friday 13th if one of the Yeah, yeah, check if it's not in there. Yeah. I was hoping it, because I have some. Nightmare on shit. Elm Street reboot as well. Why not? They did they did a Nightmare on Elm Street reboot. I watched the Same guy show. though. Same guy though, right? Probably. Probably because he's still he was still active, last I recall. Alright, well, whatever. Fuck it. Let's get some action. Let's get some anger. We're already talking about Barfy. Let's be a let's be fucking let's be pissed. The fuck you of the week goes to Barfy. <laughs> wow. Okay. So. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Guess right, who the so first... So we have the clown motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. First fuck you of the week. Kevin Sorbo. Does it again. Let me read a tweet. The guy is sweeping. This I know all the segment. time. 
No, because we all saw Sarah cut by, by now. I agree with you, Monk. Everyone should have it. So maybe. Uh, he said, stop kneeling for the national anthem. Okay. Okay. Cool. So one, it's now do peaceful protesting. That doesn't affect anything. Now it's not kneeling. Make up your goddamn fucking mind. You piece of shit. Um, next up. Ted motherfucking Cruz. Again, wow. I know. Well, he's he's just gonna be recurring because he's just doing dumb shit. Every... <laughs> he just doesn't stop. Uh, he's going around spreading lies, saying that uh, Democrats want um, illegal aliens to vote. <laughs> um, yeah. Well, and, and I'm sure his definition of illegal alien is very wide. Yeah. Anyone who doesn't vote him. Yeah. Damn. And I'm finally. An <laughs> The biggest fuck you. And this is a big fuck you. The biggest. Right, that I've ever me. done yet. Probably. Is these motherfuckers who are feeding hot sauces yes. to, do to dogs fuck. for fucking TikTok videos. Oh my god. Oh my god. When I like, read about this. <laughs> what in the fuck? Oh my god. So this like is pissy. This is dumb. This is fucking horse shit. Who the fuck would so, do it? Well, that guy, number one, it's a well, no, the guy, TikTok The guy up there, he's uh, the vet that was telling people to stop, please. Is he? Yeah. Oh, then never mind. He's a good guy then. He's was a he? good boy. I thought that was, like, it was the guy in the video doing it. Because the dog on the no. right is the one who was a victim of it. Yeah, it's because he was talking about that he works at a vet and <laughs> this dog. Never okay, mind. So Apologies to the guy above. Fuck. Immediately want to state. So we all know dog can't eat chocolate. Right? Yep. That's just a thing we know because everyone tells us. Also, oh, turns out dog and... can't eat hot sauce. Yeah, but people are like, <laughs> dog makes funny face. Eat more. Oh my god, I'm so mad. <laughs> I can't. Oh, <laughs> I can't. It's, it's like, I just want to find don't... one of these people and yell at them for it's, half it's, an hour. It's fucking ridiculous because these fucking pieces of shit uh, treat animal life like they're not. They're not entities. They're not sentient. They want clicks. They're not... They, they want these fucking clicks. They're putting clicks. their fucking dog's life at risk for clicks. I don't even think they give a shit about their dog, though. How could they? Just want those views. How could they? This right? is fucking... Oh, my God. This is so bad. This is so scummy. Anyone who does... So, first off, any TikTok challenge is fucking Fuck right off. <laughs> What's going on, Karen? What the hell's going on here? We're talking about people who give uh, hot sauce to dogs. For TikTok it's, videos because they're scum. It makes their kidneys fail. It makes the dog's kidneys fail. Even if it didn't do anything but make the dog uncomfortably hot, like you know you would eat hot sauce. Uh-huh. Dick fucking move. Yeah. It's a just assholeness. Yeah. It's it, it is animal cruelty and, and TikTok obviously just needs to end. I, it just I, needs to end. I feel like I could easily I, I thought about this as a recurring segment at one point because TikTok is always doing something fucking stupid yep. all the time. <laughs> yep. Uh, uh, it's 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 this animal life abuse bullshit is is just like just set yourself. Let's go back to the set yourself on fire challenge, please. Can we just yeah. go back to that? Yeah, you know, just to see how long you can do it. Like yeah, like let, let, I'm okay. Just. <laughs> self-harm then at this point over fucking giving a dog hot sauce like i saw someone like putting them in like hot dogs and shit and like smothering sauces and shit on it and i'm like what the fuck dude like how much do you hate how much do you th uh yeah hate your dog hate your pet how much do you not realize that they're living creatures yeah are, that those don't are, know better those are the people who speed up when they're driving and there's a squirrel crossing the road they speed up yeah fucking monsters mm -hmm. no I do want to say, though, not everybody in TikTok is doing this. No, I'll say it. But fuck them. Fuck everyone who does this. <laughs> yep. Why not punch Honestly, I'm, I'm like willing to bet everyone who does this could. fucking challenge or laughs and try to get more people to click on their shit is probably somebody I wouldn't mind just disappearing forever. The snap. The snap. The That's snap. it. This is what we have the to snap. do. We need this to get the gems. We, we need to get them. We're going to put them in that glove. Well, I have two. We have two of them now. We just need three more. <laughs> <laughs> it's just fucked. I hate. I always hold animal life a lot higher than people life. Most of the time. 
Mm. And uh, unnecessary cruelty is always something I never thought was... Like, calling for food and not getting enjoyment out of it is is fine. But those people who are, like, whacking themselves off while they're fucking, like, calling a cow, those people need to be done. They need to be done. I mean, it's not really TikTok that's the problem. It's uh, stupid fucking people. Well, yes, but TikTok is giving them an avenue. And unfortunately, TikTok challenges that are against animals. And anyone who thought this was okay... Man, let's, let's go, go back, back to, to setting yourself challenge. up. Yeah, yeah. Let's go back to that. <laughs> let's just go back to that. It was a lot easier. People do suck. They fucking suck. This one is so stupid. This one pisses me the fuck off. Uh, I don't think. I think TikTok gave it a more of an avenue for quicker videos and allowed social media to to, to make these challenges more rampant and easier to access. It could be a YouTube challenge, but. How often are you like, oh, YouTube, someone have to find the video, go to it. There's no easy yeah. way to respond to the video. Same with uh, MySpace or Facebook. You really can't respond to a video with a video of your submission. So it, it, it TikTok kind of has a way of making these type of challenges more rampant and easier accessible to do dumb shit. Yeah. Uh, my dog likes peanut butter balls. I mean, is that peanut butter on your balls or balls shaped like peanut butter? Both. I mean, yeah, I mean. I mean, I like it too. Then, right? Sometimes it's exhausting being a blind hater of TikTok. This may be, make. Uh, I'm not a blind hater. I'm a blind hater of just dumb shit. Unfortunately, TikTok is up there all the time. I don't think I've ever seen a TikTok that I could be like, "This is nice." This is nice. <laughs> I think it's just it's it's just TikTok is 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 the uh, uh is the phone game. It's the Candy Crush of entertainment. Yeah. It's the Candy Crush. Because the whole premise is it's short videos. It's mm -hmm. short, and then you want the next one. It's more like just quick, instant gratification, but, and then um, on to the next. Go for it's it. It's not as short as Vines were. Vine had something going for it. These people get on long enough to fucking spread awful conspiracy theories and You mean do this like shit. how last night I was playing Call of Duty with somebody who works... In a hospital designed for vaccinating people. Uh huh. And they wouldn't take it if it was 99% effective with no repercussions. Sometimes people get into positions that they don't really belong in. <laughs> like, oh man. Yeah, that was fun. I was like, couldn't believe it. So I was like, I kept changing the parameters to make it even easier. And she was just a fucking dumbass. How many nines? Fun. How many point nines do you need at the end of that? Oh my it only god! Kills ninety nine point nine percent of I bacteria. Well, fuck this. Oh, I, I was I was upset. I was like, "You're shitting me right now." I don't. I didn't. Oh, she works for fucking hospitals, man. It, yep. it put me off on a tangent because that threw me off. I was like, "Wow, we're getting the one person <laughs> who is just fucking scum." I got their names. I'm gonna add them as a friend on Battle.net and see what happens. Uh, <laughs> She she never wanted to argue with me. I kept asking for her fucking opinion, and she wouldn't argue, which means she didn't know what she was talking about. Mm -hmm. That's all it comes down to. That's all it is. They wouldn't just, just wouldn't give me the intel. And also, she couldn't aim for shit. Uh, so that's even worse. <laughs> <laughs> on top of not having good <laughs> takes. Yes. She can't aim. Clearly fucking relying on aim assist. Uh, the newest one was 100% of the hospital's dog and death, but only 77%. Oh, no, I forgot the line Monk told me to ask her. And it was fucking awesome. I said the line, or something about like Hollywood elites drinking children's blood to stay young. And she agreed with me. Not yeah, satirically really or ironic. She yeah. goes, she just go, yes. She said, oh, well, actually. And then she said something. And I was like, what the fuck? Oh, that was a weird fucking game. <laughs> that was weird. Probably has TikTok. Probably does TikTok. Yeah. While Locked they're working. It. Hey, don't give drugs a bad name. Drugs are great. Um, there we go. That was the uh I use drugs every day. Like aspirin. That was the fuck you of the week, guys. Let's move on. Should we God, should we light should we lighten this up? You. Should we should we lighten this up a bit? Do you wanna lighten it up like um or should we stay angry? Because we got another angry. No, I mean, boy. what do you want to lighten it up like? Um, like what you might do with a, an object that you lighten. Enlighten or lighten like I'm doing the uh, kerosene challenge on TikTok. 
You're gonna do the kerosene challenge, but not to a person. Well, to yourself. Isn't it to yourself? What if there was some kind of ceremonial? Oh plane? shit! We gotta light up the <laughs> ceremonial candle. <laughs> Thank you. Forgot about the ceremonial candle. Jeez, man, reminded me, and then I wanted to see. <laughs> We gotta get that ceremonial candle lit. Ugh. Fuck. Right. <laughs> gotta be careful. I left this on overnight once. You know, uh, the kerosene <laughs> challenge, but for... Uh... Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> ceremonial candle's been lit. We'll stay in our hearts and true. Mm -hmm. Alright, fuck it. Let's do, um... Let's play the... Let's, 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 uh, let's play the... Let's play, uh... DC versus Marvel. How do you guys feel about that? I'm good. I'm down with that. Alright, let's do some DC. We'll I can't do... bet on it anymore. I know. <laughs> It's I fine. Know. Good. I'll ask your opinions anyway. It'll be fine. You know, yeah. first time in your life someone actually cares what you think. Oh, uh, no problem. I'm the best. But we should go to, then we should then we should go to white container. Oh, leaving it on was pretty fire hazard. <laughs> I forgot to I forgot to turn it out. It's in a glass container. Where's that fire going to go? Out of the glass container? So I'm curious if you get rid of DC or Marvel forever, what 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 do you lose? I'd lose Batman. And Batman's yeah, the best. Well, no, I mean, if if that had to go with a franchise that was the only one left for some reason, it would probably be Marvel because they've been dropping the ball on DC oh, for so fucking if, long. Uh, I like the I like Marvel com or DC Comics more than Marvel. All right, let's get back to this. Fair. Um, it did smell good. So this is called. Now I'm changing the names. Obviously, this is Limp Frost. Yeah. Limp, Limp Frost, Frost. Hi. Is actually a woman disguised as a man. What? Who uses the invention of snow, uh, a special form of precipitation that freezes everything it touches? She's also notable as being um, a villain to some very great heroes. Her father was a scientist who died while working on the invention to make the snow. A special mm. uh, form of. The fuck? Ah, do you think for the host, brother? A special form of precipitation that freezes everything it touches. The invention was intended to serve humanity, although precisely how seems rather vague. Hmm. Hi, Opti. So, is this DC or is this Marvel? Well, I'm looking at this art. Yep. This feels like Marvel art okay. to me. Why? But I've been wrong every time I've said that now. So now as I'm questioning myself. <laughs> Why do you think it's Marvel? Uh, because that guy looks straight out of fucking Tron back there, and <laughs> that feels about right. So... Monk's now thinking it could be uh it could be uh DC though, because cold base villains. Mm. They like their temperatures. They do like temperatures. They do like their temperatures. Big fan of temperatures. Almost like they need a summer ring. <laughs> Why, do most temperatures fine. Why do you say DC? Why do you say DC opt? Do 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 or what does everyone else think? Um, I know the answer. I can't open. say it. Oh, they do pop up. Okay. Sorry, I'm I'm discovering that I can rearrange my monitor into a cool configuration. Yeah. How much is left on that poll? I can't tell from up here. It's all the way up there. Uh, it's almost it? done. All right. And I said she's, she's a villain a lot. Great heroes and other adventures are super cool in Batman. What do you think of when you think of superhero? Well, I, I actually go very um, vague on these things. So, actually, this is DC. Uh, big art indicator is her eyes, Fuck. by the way. Her real name is the Blue Snowman. Uh, and her name her is the Blue Snowman? Yeah, because she dresses as a guy to be more masculine. This is DC. How does that make you feel? I, I feel... The I eyes, she has very... Uh, Not helping has the very, case for uh, keeping girl DC eyes. around. Or, or Wonder Woman eyes. She does have Wonder Woman eyes and Wonder Woman head thing. There we go. I had to censor some stuff. This is called the Limper. Hi, Limper. Although it is known that he is among the oldest living beings in the universe. Uh, having been a member of one of the first races of the universe and become sentient in the wake of the Big Bang, virtually immortal, the Limper has devoted his life to creating a natural beauty by sowing the seeds of plants, flowers, and trees upon barren and devastated worlds. All right, Johnny Appleseed. That's cool. That's all we get on him. <laughs> That's all you get. Uh, DC Comics stands for Detective Comics. All right, comics. This guy, this guy is planet hopping. 
That's a marvel. Yeah. You think it's marvel because he's planet hopping? Mm hmm. So what about, you know, Doomsday? D who gives Galactus. a fuck about Doomsday? Green Lantern Corps. Yeah, what about those guys? What about the world hopping? Um, what else? Do you, um, Superman? I said my reason. I'm sticking with it. Your reason Fuck you. Is, your reason is solid. <laughs> Look, this guy's going around planets and dropping off seeds. Like, he's I get the, it. He's the he's the 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 fictional. Well, I guess they both were. He's a Johnny Appleseed in the comic era. Mm -hmm. He sort of feels like some old god. It, well, he is an old god. Look at that guy. Look at this boy. He's, He's got gonna, a gem in his head that glows. I wonder where else little, I saw that. A little crazier in the few, in the next ones. <laughs> he could be Shazam guy before Shazam. Well, he's not Shazam guy because he plants flowers and trees. So I can tell. I can tell you that. Uh, Raven does have a demon stone mm -hmm. in the head. So let's talk about. Oh yeah, I guess that is DC as well. Also, you cannot think about the Dooms boys. There you go. An interdimensional bullshit. The Flash. How many fucking Flash bullshits is that too? Where they go across fucking universes and fucking dimensions. Man, I think the DC goes across that multiverse shit sometimes more than Marvel. Still sticking with it? You're sticking if, with your people Marvel? are sticking hard on DC, but I'm sticking with my earlier assessment because I'm always wrong. So <laughs> <laughs> you went pretty hard, pretty fast. Uh, this one is Marvel. Yeah, his real name is the Gardener. That's not a good name. That's not a good name. <laughs> it's, it's a terrible name. Your name was better. Here we go. I don't know why he keeps doing it. This guy's name is Prince Limp. This guy looks like a Musion fighter. He has the... I know, right? He has the power of concussive blast, flight, ability to survive unaided in space, sensitive brain that senses motion, increased intelligence, strength, durability, to memory. I started adding their powers when I got to the third one. Uh, mm. uh, when his powers levels began to increase beyond capacity for his containment suit, um, Prince Limp chose to commit suicide. Rather than continue oh, no. living in an isolated containment room for 14 hours a day. All right, I have my theory. What's your theory? I think this guy hangs out with the um, Fantastic Four. So this is a Marvel guy, I guess. Why Fantastic Four? Because he has a containment suit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. He's like a Doom. He's like a Doctor Doom. Uh, should I add a little bit more to this? I but mean, if you want. He's, he's a hero, by the way. He's not a villain. What are you talking about? Look at his face. Look at that uh, villainous face. He he was sort of like a an anti-hero that went under a wing of a hero. Uh, Prince Limp took a child wing. murderer. Batman. Who had abducted <laughs> someone else he knew, his kid, uh, with him Robin. when he exploded in space. <laughs> with his uniform destroyed in the blast, the naked body of Prince Limp drifted deeper into space damn prince Lim. so he committed suicide so let that be it oh we got some dc thrown out there so what do you think this was you still think it's marvel mr yeah Freeze? I'm, sticking with, I'm sticking with my marvel uh no good reason i do think he I hangs think... out with the fantastic four and that was what i based my whole thing on okay <laughs> that's a bold strategy i like it i love it <laughs> I'm, if, really I, if it. nothing I'm... else i stick with my earlier assessment Two After I'm wrong, me. I'll rethink about it. Well, that's his containment powers. Uh, once you hear his name, you're gonna you're gonna be very angry. Uh, no, <laughs> I'm, ne I'm never angry. All right, is it done? It's almost done. All right, let's let's check this out. It appears to be done. It is done. All right, his actual name is Jack of Hearts. He is Marvel. Yay! He actually hung out with Iron Man as his apprentice. Dang. Yeah. How about that? That was close. I mean, the Fantastic Four hang out with Iron Man in the tower. I mean, they all hung out with each other at one point or another. Yeah, right? all the time. They fucking love each other. This character's name's Fuck You! That's a good name. Exceptional swimmer. Who would have thunk? Go figure! <laughs> <laughs> Add enhanced strength and endurance. This character, uh, Fuck You, experiment, experimented with spinal cord tissue regeneration using, um... Oh Other God, animals, spinal cord is... tissue. Oh, come the on. The gene tool. therapy studies the human experimentation that sh she was conducting. It's a she. That's a she, by the way. Uh, are, 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 and were deemed controversial, resulting in her loss of funding. And, uh, she found a fit formula, put it on herself. She is able to transform into this creature 
and uh, human form, but she's also a cripple. Oh, she can go so back she's still forth? a cripple in her human form. Yeah. Okay, well, originally I was like, Tool, you, you fucking playing me. This is a Spider-Man villain if I've ever heard of one. But then if it can turn back, that's not Spider-Man. But it keeps its paralysis that, that she has yeah, when yeah, she goes yeah. back in human form. Yeah. So that's, that's probably a DC. DC loves them some paralyzed people. You're talking about Batgirl again? Yeah, I'm talking about Batgirl again. Uh, Did Batgirl get injected with shark DNA? Is what I'm wondering. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's how this works, right? You just you get think that's like a, a shark? That's you get not a shark. shark. It's a fucking whoop dolphin? It's not a shark. Is it a killer whale? <laughs> <laughs> it's not a shark. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the big fin and I was like I made assumptions. I feel like that would be considered racist to this creature. <laughs> yeah, yes. So what what do you think this is? I'm leaving DC now. You're leaving DC? Uh what's chat thinking? What's chat thinking? We got we got a lot of DC, some Marvel in there. Yeah, it's harder DC than uh Marvel, it looks like. It's a timer, it's almost there, yeah? It's almost there. Fantastic. These timers are a good length. Good job. Know, they're a good length. There's only two more left. You guys are getting them, you're getting them pretty well a lot this time, Joey boy. Yeah, that's probably my. It's a new record for me, probably. <laughs> you know, right? Uh, you didn't get this one right, probably, but we'll see. Uh, What'd you say this was again? Uh, DC. You are correct. This is DC. This character's name's Orca. Who would have fucking thought? He was Orca. Hey. Spinal tissue. <laughs> they're fighting. They're fighting in the tournament. <laughs> are they? Is she, is that Kill, a character? Killer whale, baby. Oh, yeah, 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 but not the same one. I thought they actually yeah. had this hero, and Different I was like, one. fuck yeah. This is called Limpy's, if anyone remembers that restaurant. What What's going on with Limpy's head? Oh, I'll get to that. Via okay. artificial red plastic hat has the power of shape-shifting, <laughs> an ability to fire projectiles of energy blasts. Um, Limpy was a scientist who grafted organic computer to their head, composed of malleable plastics that can consume any form. Uh, was recruited by a person into some other stuff. Um, they reside in a mansion. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to censor it so it doesn't go through. Um, the intentions of the person at the time of joining this group were to replace the heads of every human with plastic heads. <laughs> Limpies <laughs> ran for president of the United States as the candidate. <laughs> I'll I say mean, the sure. Later. Fuck. Uh, I, I, remind me to tell you that later. Uh, they they did drop out though. Ah. And um, that's it. That's all I'm gonna give you because there's so many. There's so much shit in this. <laughs> so much shit. In this. Okay. So what we got is somebody who has a plastic head. Yep. It's a robot head. Yep. And he's like, everyone else should have this. Yep. And the thing that they thought that would get them there is to run for president of the United States of America. Correct. <laughs> uh, Wait, Bindi Arun was actually in fourth three, really? Jesus Christ. I, I don't know, dude. Marvel. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Look at the art, though. The art should give it away. Uh, no, I don't trust the fucking art anymore, Tool. <laughs> Why? It's because every time I've trusted the art, I've been wrong. And every time I say bullshit, I'm right. <laughs> 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 Sounds like we're going to wine country next. Hell yeah, let's, we can yeah, who's there, but we need to figure DCR out who's style. who's giving all these people plastic heads. This person is. How much this time person? A little bit, like this there much. You know. All right, sweet. It's so far, it's all the way up there. So it this person's is name done. is Ruby Tuesday. Oh, sorry, not Tuesday. Ruby Thursday. Ruby Tuesday is a place. <laughs> yes, it was Ruby Thursday. Sorry, because Ruby Tuesdays wasn't enough. <laughs> uh, Where are they from? They are from Marvel. They uh, they were running a president and the candidate of Global Head. Uh, with oh, that's a political clever. party under the slogan, New Heads for Old. Subtle. Now, Subtle. here's my problem. Yeah. Are they are they are they gonna put your brain into the robot head or like yes. are you just like gone? I, I oh, don't okay, know. That's cool. I don't know. I'm making that up. I have no This seems mind. like a bad strat. <laughs> I hate the zoom thing sometimes. Alright. For one, your head looks like shit now. Um <laughs> This is a good one. Okay. What's this guy's <laughs> this name? This is the final one. 
This is called Turn of the Limp. Oh, look at this turn. Yeah. He has a flamethrowing umbrella, flying bicycle, a magic horn that kills people under age 65. <laughs> Older than that, Wait. you're good. <laughs> Older than that, you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> it, like, it just stops there because it's like, well, they don't got long anyway. He, we he, can wait. He is a son of a millionaire chauffeur. I just... Uh, is he 65? Had been a responsible for uh, rebuilding... Um, <laughs> much of San Francisco after the quake, you know, the quake that was in that one movie. Okay, so he is 65 or older. Uh, so he can blow the horn without dying. Uh, we gotta take into account when this comic was made. <laughs> well, now I don't know. His, his mustache is very black, is all I'm saying for yeah, somebody. So, um, uh, let's see I here. Have, why is he riding a bike made for two with a mannequin tool? Uh, well. I can't say a lot of this stuff. <laughs> uh, he he doesn't like stuff that is is new. It feels like oh, social yeah, uh, right. new social things. He uh, he doesn't like it. He he tried to destroy San Francisco because he believed it was becoming too new, and he wanted to make it rebuild it as yeah. old and how it should be. He always carries a handlebar mustache and that straw little ha the, the striped hat and striped outfit. I I got my I got my guess. What's your guess? I think this is I think this is a DC. Okay. I think this goes well with Superman's stupid ass villains. But isn't Superman older than No, he's not. He's not older than 65, so he's a mute. No, oh, he's he's vulnerable to the horn. Oh no. <laughs> Aha, Superman, we finally got you what because Opti, you're not old what did enough. He put it on. He put it on uh what is He put it on the Marvel? Yeah, I went hard on Marvel. Well, he went big dick Marvel. Someone went big dick DC. All right, here we go. This is Marvel. Damn. Why only one I was wrong on. Uh, no, you're wrong on the first one, too. Only one was this one. <laughs> the real name is Turner D. Century. I fucking hate this. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes, I'm Turner D. Century. <laughs> Turner I hope to rebuild. <laughs> Some kid has to open up a fucking history book and read that Turner D. Century. He was disturbed fixed. by alleged degeneration of manners and more subsequent of decades in the subsequent decades after failed movement that hardy started to correct the social decline he retreated with young recently orphaned clifford as a surrogate son whom he sheltered from the current world and taught to idolize earlier times so basically he was brainwashed but there we have it there we got marv versus right. dc he doesn't use real settings that's true what well, it does sometimes it references them but yeah usually they don't I think it's Gotham City tool. Gotham. Gotham City. What do you guys think? Those it's getting harder to find obscure bullshit, by the way. It's getting really yeah, hard to find. Yeah, imagine doing uh... Yeah, but mine's <laughs> the same themes. And uh yeah, that anyway. was good. That was pretty good. That was good. Alright, let's go to wine country. Oh, let me slam this quickly. Yeah, slam it so that I can pull out my wine opener. I gotta get mine too, actually. Gotham City, the city Actually, of I, justice. I think this might screw open. We'll find out. What is it? That looks like a twist off. We'll I find hate out. You. Sometimes they put a cork under there. Really? No, nope, no cork underneath this one. You lucky bitch. All right. I know. Let's, let's go. Let's go to wine country. Let's get that that sexy wine country action going for us. Hit me up, God. Sexy wine country. Now that I know what people can hear us talk during this bit. I know. Well, because we have the same sources, so it doesn't cut over. Do, 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 do. City of Justice. Dude, I should karaoke Gotham, Gotham City, right? Gotham City! That the fun part so about sick. switching to bottles is that, like, I'll be able to drink this for the rest of the week. It's going to be great. Really? You're not finishing it tonight? <laughs> should have drank an entire bottle of wine on top of the other stuff I drank? Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'll die. I, anyway. That's, that's my hope, right? Today, what Joystick has in this... I love being able to layer different camera shots because this looks stupid. <laughs> looks awesome. <laughs> I've got Pinot Noir from uh, Fire Firefly Ridge, hmm. California, USA, made in the year 2018. 14% alcohol. What do you got, Tool? I have. Well, how much do you spend on it? Uh, this was $6.99. Ooh, you went fancy. Yeah. Yeah, you went fancy, boy. I went 
Tiny umbrellas at Cabernet Savon, also done in uh in, in California. Mine was four dollars and ninety-nine cents. <laughs> oh, very nice. I, I tried to find the cheap, cheapest but... wine I could find. At Safeway, when I went to go like at cheap wine, it was all like barefoot and shit that like everyone's had before. Like I wanted to go interesting. I gotta figure out how to use this fucking thing again. I can't even remember. Oh, that's how you do it. I figured it out, because I'm the best. Corkscrews. Yeah, well, it's a fancy boy. Here we go. All right, do a little so. locky action, a little pulley up like this, and a little pulley back like that. Boosh! The best. Post the last time where I fucked up this part, we do rate these on different criteria. We do. Color, clarity, aroma, body, taste, and finish. Oh my god, mine smells fucking Each one is terrible. a 1 through 5 point scale. And that's where we will decide how great this wine is. I'm already that we upset. Got from this I'm already upset. Why is that? Is it like green or some shit? It's rancider, smellier than shit, dude. It... Oh my god! This is this is great. We got to start with color tool. It's dark. Yeah, mine too. It's very dark. I don't even think you can. I don't think light breaks like through color. it. It's like it's like pure dark. I've got these. Yeah, I've got like these stage lights, and I can barely see. Yeah, you can, I can't right see. I it. can't see through shit. So, this is going to be sketchy. So, I'm going to say color clarity, I guess, three. I don't think it's supposed to be the dark of night, like, no light breaking through it. But, I mean, at least it's not white or clear. You get what you yeah, pay mine... for sometimes, right? Well, I was hoping to find, like, a hot I, ticket. I like this color, though. I'm still giving it a five for mine. Really? I'm still, I, I mean, this is, this is not impressing me. This is just like, hey. This is the dark. color of wine. <laughs> okay. Uh, aroma. Oh my god, this is. I'm wanting this, this bad is, boy. Well, clarity. This... Clarity is next. No, it's aroma, color clarity you... is one thing. Yeah, I know, but I still have it on. Like, Fine. I got it's two separate things. <laughs> I'll, 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 after going forward, I'll make it two separate things. That's fine. That's fine. It's how it is in the spreadsheet now, baby. All right, I'll, I'll, I'll do spreadsheet going forward next time. Dark like tool soul. If I had one. Clarity? Eh, it's clear enough. <laughs> <laughs> clear enough? All right, fair enough. I mean, I would give my color a five. The clarity is three. That's fair. Mm -hmm. Body. It means we're going to have to drink this. <laughs> uh, well, aromas. Now you can tell me about your aromas. Oh, yeah. My aromas one. Fucking hell. That's it smells so bad. I might like hold my breath when I drink it. It's you know? supposed, mine is supposed to smell like ripe strawberries and spices, which mine's I appreciate the bottle for telling me. Smell like robust and balanced. I can kind of, it's like pepper and, uh, well, it is a little fruity, but I don't fruity think strawberries. Yeah, I give it, I give mine like a solid th uh, three. I don't like the way it smells very much, but it's I, not bad. All right. All right. Tasty, tasty, tasty. Body. <sighs> this is actually weird. one of the better ones I've had in recent history. That was weird. I don't know what the fuck just happened. Mine is thicker than water, so it's better than the last one I Mine had. Mine is lighter than water. What the fuck? Yeah, it's because it's probably more alcohol than water it's, in it. You know, it's 12.5%. It's not that much. It, it can still be more alcohol than water, depending on how they made it. I guess. That's true. Fucking hell. Yeah, a little metallic-y, I would suppose, but we're not there yet. So body-wise... I'm not going to put a note for body. Like, it's fine. It's fine. Body's three. It's just weird. It's just because of how dark it is. It just it throws you off for a second. You know. I'm trying to. Oh boy, that hit me. No, weird. you're not. You're not, Matt. Did you watch it, Lucy? Lucy, did you watch Barfy? Mine's a little. Metallic. And hi, Lucy. I'm gonna give mine a three on taste. I'm gonna give mine a three on taste. It doesn't taste as bad as it smells, which but it doesn't taste like much. That's the thing. It has like no flavor. It has like Enough. nothing. The finish. How does it feel after you finish drinking? There's it? no finish. There's no Mine aftertaste. Tastes better in the aftertaste than it does in the initial. Mine tastes like nothing, and it's fucking weird. Mine, like, it might help them reading the notes about how it's supposed to taste, so that doesn't help me any. No, but, but I do get a little bit of the black cherry flavor after I've had it. I mean, yeah, I guess there's a little bit, bit of there's a little bit of grape. Like, it tastes like a grape in there. I hope it tastes like a grape. I know, but it's like really strong, like a pungent, like a like, like a grape. No. But there's this like one nothing. rated higher than my previous weeks. 
Uh, I'll give so it a that's good. I'll give it a three because it's at least not bad. My uh, total for this drink is a three point eight and one third. I gotta bust out my calc. I gotta spreadsheet this shit going. That's forward. why the spreadsheet is useful. I know. At some point, I'm putting all of them on there, and then I, I can share it in the thing. Mine's a two point six. It's a solid two point six. Lucy, you didn't miss shit. <laughs> you didn't miss shit, Lucy. Lucy, Barfy is such a weird movie. Thanks for thanks for that one. <laughs> Thank you. Oh fucking hell, Barfy was ass. You can watch his the name Vox. was Murphy. <laughs> No, no, I can't even, I can't imitate it. I think they're breaking TOS. Um, yeah, they, they definitely, like, they just, like, zoom in on it. Fuck and he's you, like, Chris. The only can say his name as. <laughs> I give the show Asagi a 1.125 out of 5. Maybe you should give your dick a sucking first there, Crispy, you piece of shit. Damn, well, I can't believe we're getting roasted by <laughs> I know, fucking Chris. snipes. I know, the guy who, who uh, is never around when he says he's going to be... And uh, he dies all the time in Smite. Uh, Lucy, <laughs> I don't know. What do you define as the last, the the last part? Because like, is it the last hour of this movie? <laughs> I don't know. It's all you know, right? It's all Lucy. It was such I feel a good you though. Yeah, I feel you, Lucy. I'm gonna finish this fucking bottle of wine now. This sucks. You don't have to finish it. Don't you have a cork? Like one I'm of not these. I'm not gonna use it. No, I use green. This is creepy. It's Ooh. blue, but it's a light blue. Ooh. I'll finish it. Fuck it. I'll finish this bottle tonight. Uh, well, maybe I won't. Yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe I won't. Because I got to make a cocktail still. Yeah, what don't finish a bottle of wine and drink a cocktail. Just, you know, savor it. Ah. You'd be like me. I've got a wine rack back there. You can't see it because I have a green screen in the way, but, you know, shove it on there. I have a wine rack. I just, this, it's filled with good wine. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's your mistake right there. I know, right? I gotta get this fucking cork. Yeah, do it like me. It's only got wedding wine <laughs> from Mine two years ago. And... Yeah, I have some of those too. Ah, uh, let's get this fucking thing out here. Uh -huh. Let's try to get this fucking thing out. There we go. Yeah, I'm just gonna jam that cork. Redacted. Okay. I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna make my drink today because I feel like making it. Do, 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 my favorite do. part about this wine stopper is how it has wood grain texture on it. There we go. We recorked the bottle. I'll be drinking that all day tomorrow. It's going to be great. All right. Let's go to wine country. Let's go yeah, back. Actually, this is a silly place. It's a place of champions. I'm learning a lot about wine, though. Thanks, I know. wine country. All right. What, what, what do we got? We got... Uh, what, what have we done? Did, we, did I add the drink for that wine? I don't think I did. Did I? I don't know if I added that drink count for that wine. Uh, I did. I, I did. Know. I did. I'm gonna say I did. I don't know. I, I guess I could add for it too, Here. technically, at this point. Yeah, you could. Here we go. Let's talk about your movie. Oh yeah, they're making Ace Ventura three. Everybody, hooray! Written by the <laughs> people who made Sonic. <laughs> From the fine people, of course, because they already have context tacked with Jim Carrey. Right. So, but let's talk real briefly about things that don't need to happen. I think things Ace Ventura like, three is one of them. Ace Ventura 3, where Jim Carrey is like, I don't know, Sonic was 80 fun. years old. <laughs> He's... So, you know, here's the, here's the thing. So we have, why can't people just, you know, I don't know, create a new thing? Yeah. Why are we reliant on things that are already cults or have the niche following or just old and make a sequel that you know is just not going to be good? It's a fucking cash grab is the problem. It's, it's a I'm... shitty cash grab because it's going to be on HBO Max. It's not going to go to the theaters. <laughs> And you have to release the Snyder Cut of Ace oh Ventura 2. I like the Snyder Cut. You watch the Snyder Cut? Oh, of course I watch it. I watched it before. The movie's long. I, I was supposed to watch it on Saturday, and I opted not to because that movie long. Yeah, it's four, four hours long. I liked it. They got rid of a lot of the comedy. They added more backstory to some of the characters, but that doesn't matter. That's not what we're talking about. Um, Unlike Ace Ventura, which will have no comedy. Right. It's going to be very serious. It's going to be it's gonna be shit, and they're going to make a lot of dumb... Uh, references gonna, to current okay. times. They're going to make references to the old movies. Lucy, so, The Grudge is the new movie for next week. You should check it out. It's a really good one. It's one of my favorite yeah. movies, actually. Uh, Okay, so what are things that will definitely be in this movie because they have to have it, right? Yep, 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 yep. What is it? All right. Jim Carrey talking out of his ass, literally. Yep, definitely. Uh, At some point, for inexplicable reasons, he's going to have to pretend to be the white devil again. 
He's going to have a love interest and a daughter. He's gonna have a kid. He's gonna have a kid. There's no doubt. Oh, he's yeah. gonna have a kid. Well, it's because they have to set it up for the next sequel where it's his child who's now the ace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's a title you hand it down to your children like um like an old pair of pants. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Shouldn't. Um, <laughs> all right. Um, what else? I think is it was be a good game. Way? Clam chowder. Clam chowder. Like, okay. I never. Do you want to know a confession? I've never seen any of the Ace Ventura's. Why don't we put an Ace Ventura movie on the wheel? Are they on Netflix? <laughs> Probably. I don't know. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll check real quick. I'll do a little research on the side. Don't worry about me. I just saying these movies. It's like saying let's do Ferris Bueller's Day Off too. Like why? It's still his day off. He's fifty years old now. <laughs> fifty years old, and he does it as a work now instead of school. Oh, it's Ace Ventura is not available for streaming for free anywhere. But is Go Ace Ventura figure. two? Oh my god! Amazon Prime has Ace Ventura two. Wait, are they have you been given joystick? What do you mean? Ace two is on Prime. It is. You want me to add to the list? <laughs> Remind me to add it to the Please list. Do. <laughs> Spin wheel. All right, let me add it to It's the way list. better than the fucking <laughs> Murphy. Oh my god. Uh, I don't know if I try Monopoly man. Oh, so good. I hope they make another one. There we go. It's added to the wheel. Make the another one 15 years later. The wheel now has Ace Ventura 2. Fucking hell. I don't know. Well, I, mean, I, this I like... hate this. I hate these sequels. I hate these reboots. Just fucking make something else. Yeah. You have heirloom pants. It's not like you can't go and watch the old one. It's easier than it's ever been to go and back and watch the old one. But why do you need the same characters? They already concluded. It's not like there was a cliffhanger. It's not like it's like a, a cinematic universe where like, what's gonna fucking happen next? It's just I don't know. Fucking it's... just make something else, or just make a new movie that has the same themes and just call it something anything. else. Crocodile Dundee Fifty Eight. We don't I don't need know. to make. We don't have to put fucking. <laughs> Jim Carrey on the marionette strings and make him dance on the screen for an enjoyment. We don't need to do that. I mean, he's not that funny. <laughs> he was an anti-vaxxer for a bit, too. I'm still holding it to him. He was almost like Evan Sorbo. Oh, my God. Fucking Jenny McCarthy. Or he Healy. Um, let's go to... We don't, we're actually almost out. I'm going to make my drink. Actually, let's, let's make the drink. Fuck it. Make it. Let's make the drink. So let me slam this fucking wine quickly. Oh. Hey, that game is getting a patch that fixes the cup soon. I know. I'm actually going to probably finish it. We're going to make a drink from Cyberpunk called the Jackie Wells. I'm saying his name right. Oh, Wells. yeah. <laughs> the The moment in that game where you get the instantiated as an actual drink is one of the moments in that game that are actually like really touching. So, let's make the Jackie Wells. No, fuck Johnny English. The fact that that still keeps happening pisses me off. Mr. Bean is made of glass at this point. He is so fucking old. Right? Like, there's... I don't know why he agreed to do that shit, dude. Like, that Because he the, wants money? He made a Johnny English, what, like, two years ago? One year ago or something? Before COVID. Know. Like, right before COVID. And it was ass! Obviously, it's gonna be ass. I, unfortunately, watched it! Alright, let's get back to the fucking topic here. So, we gotta make... Oh, Jackie Wells. It's half an ounce of lime juice, one mm -hmm. ounce of vodka. So hold on. They say the recipe like 18 times in that game. So do they really? No, oh, they say it a lot. <laughs> well, hands. Depending if you go back there and talk to the bartender more. Well, apparently yeah. there's like an extreme version of it where it's like or legendary where you use egg whites and then you got to go even more bigger dick and I can't be bothered. They don't oh, say that in the game. I know, but they said it in on the the, the recipe. Fucking liars. Like, one ounce are. of vodka. Here's, here's the thing I had to go buy today. An ounce of vodka. Never heard of it. No, 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 no. Irish mist. Never heard of it. But I got it. So let's fucking use it. How the fuck do you? I knew it, Lucy. Thing? I was saying I'm gonna have to watch three grudges. The, the sate my grudge lust. Oh, dude, the, I'm. I'm you I like watch, to do my due diligence. You should watch actual. Also, also it's only like 15 minutes because there are a bunch of shorts. There's one called Grudge White and Grudge Black, and I think Grudge Black or Juwan Black, and I think Juwan Black is awesome. I, like, I don't know if I want to go out of my way. It's, fi it's 15 <laughs> minutes of awesome. And it's fucking I, weird. But, 
with the ring, I thought it was really informative to watch the original ring on top of the one we actually watched because it helped. Well, Grudge, I know. I know Grudge 2 goes off the fucking end. Like, it's yeah, nothing. Yeah, fuck Grudge 2. I'm not going to watch Grudge 2. I'm going to watch three different Grudge movies and they're all the first Grudge. <laughs> Let's put some fucking nice Irish mist in here. Boom. Now we oh, gotta yeah. do a nice little Lucy, shaker. The, the grudge we're gonna watch is the 2004 one. Yes, with uh, not not the classic. The classic, not the fucking new one that was really terrible. Like my god, even though it has Buffy in it, Sarah Michelle Gellar. So then we pour this little sexy boy into this drink, and it says just top off with ginger beer, right? Just a little little toppy boy, a little toppy, so you don't get you don't get the super super gingery beery flavor. Let's try this fuck around. Now, I'm just waiting for some pretentious asshole to go into an actual bar and ask for a Jackie Wells and hope that they actually give him something. I need a Jackie Wells! I want the legendary Jackie Wells. You better get those fucking egg whites out there, right? Alright, there we go. Jackie Wells has been made. I might have even overflowed it a bit. I didn't get cock and bull because it's also overpriced, but it also tastes the same. Some of it's different. It's slightly like, different. Cock and Bull is like a reliable, easy one to find. Goslings is fine too, though. Yeah, Goslings is okay. But Cheers. not like where I'm at. I don't got Goslings. Goslings is also a lot cheaper. It's not bad. It's actually. Hmm. A little honey. Like that, that Irish mist really cuts. Cuts through. I don't even know what Irish mist is. It's a honey whiskey. But it's. It, I think it counts as a liqueur. But it's not. What is this? Oh yeah, it is an uh, it's an Irish whiskey. Yeah, it's thirty five percent, but it says it's a honey liqueur, but it's thirty five fucking percent. Makes no the sense. Honey rich is pure sugar, dude. You can make a lot of things out of honey. A rich liqueur blended with Irish whiskey, honey, and natural aromatic spices. Fantastic. Monk, get out of here! Your Canada dry bullshit. <laughs> fucking hell! Tell me to drink Schweppes. Get out of here. <laughs> Schweppes. I don't know. Let's 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 try this again. Um, I actually like it. It's, it's this is like one you would get at a a nice bar, not like a shitty like dive, but like a good bar. You'd be like, go have the Jackie Wells, and they'll know. I'm gonna try this when bars reopen. I'm gonna go and be like, I'll have a Jackie Wells. It's good luck. I know. <laughs> Unless you're at like Ground Control or something around here where they're nerdy enough that they might actually have it on. You the never menu. fucking know. They might do it. And then I'm gonna tell them what it is. I'm like, it's a fucking Jackie Wells. Maybe get some fucking culture, you bitch. And then they'll spit <laughs> you don't know and come Jackie Wells, drink. the yeah. greatest runner of all time. Yeah, he's died the greatest tragically. fucking runner, dudes. He self-sacrificed himself, even though he was already dying. Come on. It's true. It was good. It was good. All right, let's let's go on some bullshit. Uh, let's get some bullshit. We're gonna do some uh, fun. We're gonna do uh, this bullshit. Let's. Go. I just wanna. I wanna test out my new setup. Okay. So that's pretty much all I'm doing with this. So we're gonna do uh, some tool bet. Tool bets. So we should go to the fucking arena. Oh yeah, we we uh, we have we, the arena now. We got the well, it's not the same arena. We're gonna go to the different arena, which I gotta redo uh, well, that. I mean, yeah. Oh, we're we gonna only go to the can old rent school. A big arena on Wednesdays. Yeah, the big arenas are Wednesday. We gotta reset. It's expensive. The All right. I like this arena though. This is a good arena. It's a good know. arena. It's got a big screen. It's got the biggest. Oh shit! That guy was loud. You shall not forget this devil's power. Well, why not? Yep. So I like the all limited time because we're not running this automatically. So me closing it out is the best thing. So I like that. We're gonna keep that how it's going. I didn't put unlimited. Oh, I yes, did. Yes, we did. Yes, we did. We moved it back so all of them have it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's right. So I don't know, Virgil and and uh, Cell. So Cell, we all know, is a piece of shit. I'm going Virgil because usually is... all those DBZ fuckers suck. This is the pre-perfect cell that all the people got yeah, fetishes but, about because not, he sucks people up in his tail. But do you guys not see Virgil's animations right there? That's some fucking sick shit. He has some frames. He's got some fucking frames. Can you guys wait till the golden the god appears cursor. in the battle? There we go. Cursor's gone. Thank you. you can you can you wait for the golden god to appear in the, in the fray? It's impossible. Bonus round. It doesn't happen. Bonus round. We're going to watch a promo after this too. Which is important. There's some secrets in the promo. What? Okay, I, yeah, bonus points if anyone can guess what the fuck it is. Hmm. The best part about doing it like this is that if somebody goes off mark and just murders the other person, still mm -hmm. won't end around. Nope. 
I know, we noticed that with Neosef. Yep. Which was great. <laughs> Just can't be automatic like this. But we still can't make it automatic nope. anyway. Twitch, get your fucking act together. When, uh, when is Tool getting spoons for this Monday podcast? What does spoons mean? Spawns. Sponsors? Oh, spawns. I thought it was spoons. It's so far away now. Ah, dude, I would love to get sponsored. What, Any what sponsor. do you think do you think we could get sponsored? Well, Crystal Farm sponsors. He gives me free cheese and booze occasionally. Yeah. I don't think I, you can I, get you see a these glasses? sponsorship because I feel Why like that's not, gonna... though? Why not though? I mean, of... you could have Bud Light com commercials. Yeah, I mean, and, and they have can. the Bud Light streamer, so why not? Yeah, I don't think I, I would I would argue this shit off of fuck it. I'm going to YouTube then. Suck it. I'm not going to YouTube. Fuck that. Suck it. All right, is a bad is a bad son? Let's get the fight going. I gotta manually do the fights going forward. See, look at that. Isn't that nice and smooth? You don't have to. I mean, you could put it back to the way it was before. <laughs> no, I meant like I just can't tell when the bet's done. I told you Virgil's gonna win. Well, Virgil's the boy, but Cell, like Cell is um, I mean he's trying to attain perfection. He is. And that's admirable. Yeah, cut the time down to a minute, Monk. We're only going to do like three of these. What's wrong? Dang, that though. was so good. Yeah, Cell's these, not this doing is, shit. Uh, there are this two different done. tiers here. Yeah, this is this is oh, this is open. Yeah, oh we're in God. opens here. I wonder what Virgil ranked. Uh, I can find that out. It might be. I added a bunch of fighters. <laughs> Yeah, and you haven't given me a new update on No, I have not. I, I'm, I'm, I'm maybe thinking of just running it, so then you can always access it. Now, at some point, we're going to have to... Yeah. We're gonna have to change the way it's raining, because some of this is kind of fucked. Virgil is... <laughs> Thank you. A Thank you, cheese, man. fighter. I don't know which cell this is, so, so it's hard for me to... rank him. A lot of cells. We have no, so many cells. I'll just, I'll just there tell you are that 11 it. cells in this game. Where's your motivation? We gotta figure out where the audio Man, can transmit. Virgil's I might do that through Discord next going. time, where I'll just send the video to you on Discord next time. This is weird. We got M Vegeta Super Saiyan 3 versus Chibi Naruto. Um, I wonder if it's an, actually a dash in the thing. Yep. Uh, M Vegeta is a D class fighter, thirty seven point nine percent. We should rate. not give their, their should not give their shit. <laughs> or right, let's see what TV Naruto Naruto is about. I would bet higher than fucking Vegeta. Uh, almost identical. These really? are both D rank fighters. Ooh! I want to add more Star Wars fighters in there. I would like more uh um clone soldiers. I would like more. The problem is, I can't play any Star Wars music anymore, and you're actually not allowed to play any Star Wars games on Twitch anymore. Oh, because the music will get auto-flagged like that? Yep. Yep. At least we can do Star Trek bullshit. Right? Because no one gives a shit about Star Trek. <laughs> <laughs> a Jar Jar you know, fighter? Down to it, I, I prefer Star Trek to Wars if we want to compare apples and oranges. In, in, in terms of movies or in terms of games? Ugh. Probably movies. Games gets murky because I have nostalgia for some Star Trek. Versa, I, I, I'm really big fan Wars of games. you know the, the the prequels, but Star Trek didn't have a pod racing game. Well, that that's the thing. Ass. I think I think the Star Wars games tend to be a lot better. With when I say this, I'm talking 90s till 2010. <laughs> then shit gets a little bit murky, right? I'm starting the fight, monk. Close it down. Shut it down. Oh, did he chibi the shit out of that? Damn it, Naruto. Why do you have to do that? Making me all confused. We'll do one fight, maybe two more after this, and we're going to show the promo. Then we're going to continue on. Look at this boy charging up. He's a chargy boy. <laughs> it's all he wants to do is charge up. <laughs> Let the boy charge. He's just he's yeah. Just I know it was the sexy jutsu monk. I like how it has its own music in bet mode still, which is great. Oh yeah, I never turned it's it off. There. It's so terrible. It's such a bad music. It's just a shitty piano. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. The stages have their own music, so <laughs> can't wait till we get to Warcraft to get levels. 
Incidentally, this segment might end up muted at some point if I don't change that. No, 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 no. I, uh, I, this, that's, the sound effects from the fights aren't being recorded. Oh, interesting. Yeah. It's on the desktop audio, which is the same as the alerts, so they don't get saved in the VOD. Probably for the best. Oh. Which I also do change for the tournament. That was the most boring, uneventful fight I've ever fucking seen. The two D-ranked fighters tool. My God, this is boring. What, who, who's, who's, this what's is, the crowd favoring right now? What's the crowd favoring? I don't know. I can't see the percentages anymore. Maybe I can. If I open up the prediction menu manually, will it show me? The crowd is favoring uh, Vegeta here. Heavily. Boy, were they fucking wrong. Boy, were they wrong. Did anyone say Naruto was going to win? One person. Opti. That person, Opti, was right. Man, Opti's picking right today. Quite literally right, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Wow. Fuck you. That was great. <laughs> <laughs> this is a cool move. I feel like if Naruto used this I can make a bunch of me move better, could get out of D rank into higher right, tiers. Right. I mean, he, he's the problem is his damage output is absolute shit. I think if any of them take damage, they all take damage. But this allows them to be relentlessly aggressive. Yeah. Also, his AI sucks ass. Yeah, look, he just took a big dick hit right here. Do not make this a third rounder, please, for the love of God. Come on, Naruto, just finish him so we don't have to do this shit. Naruto does what Naruto will. What are you talking about? Vegeta is a waifu. Look at his beautiful hair. That's good hair. Thank God. No, left is not a girl. Left is a guy. Are you shitting me? <laughs> oh, Dragon Ball. <laughs> Whoa, Frozen, what's going on, baby? Oh, oh. no, not Kasa. They, <laughs> oh, nuts. boy. What the fuck is it? Inzuku Kiba. I don't know what to expect uh, from this do, nonsense. Who will win, Armor Man or Worms? I don't know. I don't know. I, I mean, I, I the left kind of has me questioning because it's so simple, so nothing. There's no animation there. Yeah, but the right... It could be anything. Could be the fucking Esmeralda bullshit. It's the same thing, right? It looks like the... the Esmeralda the the, yeah, 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 yeah. So so maybe the his boyfriend's going to come out and just carry the team again. Possibly. I don't know. Let's see. Let me. I'm gonna uh, do some behind the scenes looking here. We need someone to bet on right. Someone needs to bet on on right. I mean, that's the only play here. I don't have betting a on left. Casa All right, we did it. My... He might have been. Yeah, have I don't have either name. of these fighters in my list. They must have like a different. Fucking or they might have weird folder names. Yeah. They have weird folder names. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, fight starting. Let All him right. close it down, monk. Fewer bets on left, but bigger bets. Right has three. Oh, left has in two. they're speaking Spanish. That's a sketchy thing, or Portuguese. Left turned into a kid. Oh, okay. This looks like a that looks like a Naruto. Who's just launching balls? I think that the kid is not gonna win this fight. <laughs> uh, he's, he's not as aggressive as Ball Boy. Ball he Boy has two power is up. Extremely... Oh shit! Oh god, that's so loud! <laughs> it didn't do anything though. <laughs> what is happening? I think he managed to punch him. Nope, we missed. <laughs> oh my god, I hear it through <laughs> your headphones. Can you really? It's so loud. <laughs> Yeah, left is fucked. He, he's calling in all of the characters from that anime. What the fuck is happening? Watch, he has like a... Uh... No, he turned into a flower boy. We're gonna do one more after this. It's so fucking loud. Thanks, Casa de Limonades. So fucking loud. That's how you need to know if you, uh, that's how you know they're winning. Um, Jeez, man, I think you should just triple down on the next fight. And that's like, your one. I like how they got a hit on 
gold armor man real early, and it did no damage. It is so fucking loud. What the fuck <laughs> is this? Hi, lady. Nope, went the other direction. That was a dumb play. Inzuka doesn't do a god shit for damage. Zero What's damage. What's going on, Jen? How was your Phasmo? Sorry, Jen, it's super loud. Super loud, we're just doing a little uh, precursor for the round two of the tournament, which starts on Wednesday. Two AI people are fighting it out, and we're betting on it. These two fighters are not tournament material. <laughs> These are not tournament material <laughs> fighters right here. We're going to do one more random battle, and then we'll show the promo. Oh, he just one-shot him! Oh, that was that attack. Wow. It actually hit that time. Oh, my God. So we have uh, uh, 2,000 fighters-ish, I think, right? A little over 1,000 for sure. I know I cleared out a bunch. And now we're just saying open enrollment fighting. This is going to be great. I don't know what the fuck this is. Oh, we yeah, don't even get to that... see their fighters here. But you put, on left, right. you put on right. We don't even have their names. My guy we... on the right is from Street Fighter Alpha. Right, right, right. He's cool. Guy on the left, guy on the left. From poison. Him. Okay, um, yeah, that makes sense. The guy on the left, I think, is from Samurai Showdown. People started using scream jump scares against me. Yeah, I know. Those scream jump scares for you are as fucking loud as balls. Why would they do this? I know. That's almost as bad as giving a dog hot sauce. I haven't played Phasmo in what? Well, when was the last time we played Joystick? Because I think the last time I played was with you. Damn, that was a long time ago, dude. <laughs> right, that was a long time ago. But I'm level 400. Oh, that's pretty cool. I'm, I'm like, like level dude, 60. Are you done after this? Do you want to play a round or two? I could play something. All right, let's play something. What do you want to play? We could do Sings, or we could do uh, Phasmo, or anything, really, actually. Well, I yeah, I don't have any bias, but I don't have Phasmo installed at the moment, so it would take me You a cunt. All right, start the fight, or when it starts to end the, end the betting there. Like DJ Max, respect me. <laughs> I have DJ Hero. DJ Hero. Uh, I know DJ different. Max, too. O2 Jam? I got O2 Jam. Do we have O2 Jam? I loved O2 Jam. I'm good at O2 Jam, baby. Yeah, O2 Jam rules. I know. Fucking best. Garg, Garg left uh, a land party. On that game. He was pissed. Alright, sword boy. Use your sword. I mean, hey, you're getting money for it. Right. Milk the shit out of it. So, Sword boy is Andrei kicking ass right now. Samurai is... Is a grapply boy. Yeah, and Samurai is from Samurai Showdown, I imagine. I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he's from Samurai Showdown. He looks like a Samurai Show. He looks but like a Samurai Showdown. Has, has did not uh, wake up. Does the guy remind you on the right remind you the guy from the mask? Not the not the Jim Carrey, the other one. Also, I th I think this guy's just called Andre in actual game, but oh, he's a grappler boy, all right, but it's just not yeah, enough. Yeah, he's a grappler. Holy shit, boy. he just he's doing some big dick energy here. It's something, Jen. It's also what two a.m. for you? Oh, his name is Hugo. Fuck. But his name is Andore oh, in the yeah. Final Fight C games. Unless the next fight is something important, we're gonna we're gonna uh, or something funny, we're gonna skip it and go. Jen, not two a.m. God damn. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this. We got an Evangelion thing going here. I feel like I want to see what this happens. We're gonna lose. We're going. Yeah, Justice is from. Um, yeah, two a.m. is something. Is it? Yeah. He has a this other guy. Piece. I don't know what he's from, but he's but dancing. He's, he's dancing a little closer each time. He's he's dancing and he's like doing some like. Wave dash bullshit. What time should you get up? I mean, I got up at 10, 11, 12. I don't even know when I got up. Dude, he's just getting closer and closer. He just wants to say hi. You ever what? try to do this at the at the club with at a the lady, club? you know, just like... Hey, yeah, yeah, just move into the cod piece all the fucking time. <laughs> it's like, let me give me some of that cod piece. No one's betting on uh, the right. Everyone has face and justice here, but not... Ch not justice two? here... Just look at Justice. Justice looks like he fucking destroys everything. I think Chu's got this. It's online lectures, right? See, I always wonder how those work nowadays, right? No one's betting on right. It's going to be a really shitty win because no one's betting no, somebody, on right. Oh, someone did. Cheese Man put a big, big dick oh, bet on right. Cheese Man, big dick, dude. Let's see what happens. This will be less one of something, unless like El Presidente or something really keeps me going. But Justice yeah, with the cut piece kept in. Got thousands of fighters now. I've been uh, adding watch fighters, out. He's not way. respecting the starting position. He doesn't. Oh, he's got two bars, though. Holy Secret shit. Bar. Chu is Chu is is just fucking happy as shit. Is this Cheese Man's victory right here? 
Justice, Cheese Man um, Chew is just like fuck justice. you. <laughs> Chew does not care about like all of Chew their attacks come out in like three frames, which is real fast. Dude, Chew woke the fuck up. Chew was like fuck you, Justice. I no hate this justice, level. Only Chew. I hate this level. Yeah, why did this level Music get chose sucks. again? I don't know. There's so many levels that chose this one again. Whoa, he just Hadoukened! Hadouken. Oh shit, Justice might have woke up right there. He did some couple attacks on him, but Chu is doing those high kicks and punches. Yeah, I think the Justice is pieces. trying to go in to do something, and it just does not work. Yeah, I think because of Chu, it keeps you need like to use just... your range, buddy. Yep. Yeah. Oh, there we go. What's that ultimate do? And nothing ever happens after he does it. I don't know. Come on, Chu. I'm kind of rooting for Chu for Cheese Man right now. But finally, Justice is actually doing something. Wake up, wake up. What's with the cat noises? I, I can't hear any noises, so I don't know. Wow, there we go. Chu won. Damn. And now he's going to slowly advance. <laughs> right? I'm just checking to see. Uh... Who's here? Tinkerbell and Onslaught. <laughs> really small versus really big. No, we're going to skip it. We're going to skip it. We got to keep going. We got to keep moving. Okay. I, re I really want to not skip it, but I'm going to. Really small versus really big, though. Let's go back to our room. All right. Welcome back to the room. What's going on, guys? So, we're going to watch a promo for number two. Gem, small versus big always works. Uh, yeah, but what if you're always small? Yeah, like me. Like, yeah. Like, two inches inward doesn't count. It, so, it's a second belly button. We are going to watch the fucking promo for Wednesday night. Hello, everyone. Joystick Hero here to talk about round. <laughs> we're going to re fucking wind this. Hold on a second. Let's get that screen out there, because it, 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 I want everyone to hear Joystick's fucking sexy voice. What? Don't worry about it. It's fine. Although it disappeared. <laughs> I, should just, I should just watch, like, why am I going to YouTube for it when I have the fucking file? Hello, everyone. Right, you know? That was bad. Hello. We're going to hear that hello, like, six times. Bring the TV back. Hello. 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 I, want, I feel like I should make it bigger. But I'm not Hello. Good. Just a hero here to talk about round two of the Better Than March Madness tournament. The first round has had a slew of fantastic oh, fights, with loads of unexpected upsets. <laughs> We're talking about tight. I got to say, about something else. even though I helped put this together, I did not anticipate many of these outcomes. Fortunately, the fighters who lost will be able to stand back up, dust themselves off, and hopefully be able to train for a future tournament. Except for this guy, he's a he's fucking dead, dude. With the first round out of the way, we now have the fighters poised on to take on a whole new group in round two, which is sure to be even more exciting than the first. In this round, we have Harry Ness versus Tamano Nome. Fuck you, Monk. Killer Whale versus Chikyu. Albert Wesker versus Walter Tank. Necro versus Twilight Sparkle. Twilight Sparkle's a bitch. Cherry versus Undead Soldier. Wiss versus Bowsette. Izuku versus Yuka-chan. Daimon versus Galactus. Dr. Manhattan versus C-3PO and R2-D2. NJ Uruishima versus nice Reaper. Nice speaking that name there. Saibon versus Shishiro. Throw me on blast, damn. Kenshiro <laughs> versus Final Fantasy V Omega. Li Sheng Long versus Motaro. Oh yeah, Jack the Killer got fucking rolled. Marissa versus Noob Smoke. Serena versus Ramon. Ramon. And finally, Misaka Mikoto versus Freddy Fazbear. You better be there. You always gotta have you useless explosions. You better be there. And you fucking better be there. Let's put back on this sexy music. This little ambiance. There we go. Ooh. Thank you. No problem. That was good. Good. Thanks for doing the ad lib for that one. That was I was doing too much work. 
Me better be there. Yeah. Was Monk not there for... Oh, he wasn't there for round one. Round was awesome. I had to run round one because Monk wasn't there. That's true. And round I one... I run round two anyway. Okay. Round one had so many fucking upsets and things that... I've ran the thing like 20 times. And things happened in round one that never happened in 20 mm -hmm. of the simulations. Not people winning. Legitly, wound one. Oh, dude. Wound one was... There were characters who one-shot people. That never did it in 20 simulations. Neo Seth getting KO'd. Yeah. Never saw that ever happen. Never. Ever. He had to hit him at this one, this perfect spot. One frame. One frame. That was the time he had to hit him. And he did it. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> so good. You no want to do will shots? I appreciate that as Chet, much as somebody's Are you doing shots right now? Me. Why won't you do shots earlier? But I'll do shots right now. Are you shitting me? Uh, duh. Mm. I always got the shots. I'm also drinking the Jack Wells. It's on Discord. You can read the recipe. Yep. Good old Jackie. You call it, Jen. Funny. I'll do the shot. Why would you do shots now, but not on your stream? That makes no sense. You got to milk the shot revenue. Yeah. Cheers. The shots, the shots per click or whatever. I mean, right? Yeah, whatever. However it works. Cheers. Mm. Is that, are, you, are you chugging that... Um, the Irish Mist? No, no, no. That's Peach Whiskey. Canadian, um, Canadian Brothers or some fuck. Christian Brothers. Christian Brothers. Hey, how did Songless Spot know what I say? Damn. Joey <laughs> said I'm a nuclear engineer. I should find that shirt. I have it somewhere. I think we have the last really topic shirt. before we go to the Cheese Man segment of the day. Whew. Which is uh, a simple and easy one. Um... I don't want to get it. my base one trick. Those bastards. If you ever play Phasma with people who are the best, which is me. Just two open, honestly. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, we, we have rules, though. You're never allowed to leave until you get a picture of the ghost. Yeah, that's, a, a, that's just like that, a good rule. That's just a good rule. How is the mop-up team supposed to go in there if they don't know what's yeah, in there? Yeah, they don't know the picture. You got you to gotta get a picture of the ghost, 100%. Yeah. Well, we're little trolley boys in that shit. It's great. Uh, yeah. Just send me the message. I'm in. Yeah. What's this topic there, uh, Joystick? What do you want to talk about before we get to the Cheese Man segment? Oh, my God. Okay, I only learned about this, like, a couple hours ago, honestly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, like, all right, so is, does everyone here know what a CMOS battery is? Tool does. I do. Yeah, basically, it's the little battery, the watch battery that normally goes in your computer to keep track of, like, your, so you, like, your BIOS and Game your Game Boy. Pocket. Even oh, NES games? carts had it. Yeah, um, some, some did. If they had a save feature, they had a battery in it. So they're slowly and surely taking PS3 services off the internet, right? Like that's just how that's, it's going to work, right? You know, so you know, you know that old copy of PT you might have on, on a PlayStation Three somewhere. Turns out four. with the PT was four. Was it four? It was four. Fuck. Well, it's still the same problem on that, right? <laughs> anyway, when the CMOS battery dies, in which it will, in a PlayStation Three, and yep, if four. their servers are offline, when you put a new battery in. There's nothing for it to sync the clock against anymore. Any downloadable games you have on that console will not work. Full stop. Yep. However, it's what wild. if you replace the battery? If that's what I was just saying, if you replace the battery, it can't resync to the clock of like the the thing because the servers so goes, are down. Yep. So it goes. Oh no, this is all bullshit. Is the, but so, the problem is this isn't about PS3 and also it's about titles when you play retro like I play retro this affects mm -hmm. retro gaming and PT specifically anything you've downloaded and yeah, it, this is a problem on the PS4 as well actually like, that, like, that affects physical games too though yes I was gonna say it's worse on the PS4 <laughs> but at least the PS4 servers aren't down yet but it will be eventually yeah so so what, any what deals it, any downloadable games you've ever done on a PlayStation platform are fucked in the future. So what it tells out. to me what they're going to have to fucking do is they're going to have to release an update, a firmware update to these consoles to remove those restrictions. That would be what they would do if they were cool, but they knew this was a problem. Well, they made it a problem. Not By they, design. They always knew at design point, they knew that this was going to come eventually. Right, but but like uh, some other consoles and other games, they like Friday 13th, they're not supporting the game and they're not doing it anymore, but they released a patch to make it so it's still a playable fucking yeah. game. You just got to pray the, that Sony the, decides the, the, to the, put the work in. Yeah, fucking good luck with that. The thing is, I think with enough uproar, once this actually starts happening, mm -hmm. you think I'm they'll hoping, actually go... Yeah, otherwise we'll have to rely on what our normal tactics are. You know, piracy wins. 
Piracy well, that's the wins. problem, though, with um, old school emulator people, though, is that like this affects even if you downloaded a pirated version of a thing or a cracked version on a console, it still won't launch because it still needs to try to validate against something. Right, but I'm saying maybe then at that point they'll make a thing where it doesn't validate anymore. Yeah, they'll put, probably put, bypass it. They'll they'll, they'll definitely because people always there's a will is a way. Uh, th that's kind of the unfortunate side of things is that pirates and hacked version or not hacked cracked versions of the games then have a better time than people who purchase the game because they don't have to do those all their fucking uh, DRM checks yeah. against the servers. No, and they just keep they play a better quality game. Keep in mind though, for the PlayStation Three, if you have a physical disc, you're still fine. Not for the so you though. have that going for you. PlayStation Four is where it starts getting real fucked, but that's a ways off, and hopefully people will make. That's not of that ways off. That's three weird. That's three years off tops. No, I mean I'll be sixty years old in three years. I'll be just like an old. <laughs> My liver man. is already like ninety years fucking old. Are um, you shitting me? No, but like yeah, it's this is this is one of those things. Like I have old consoles. Fucking ancient consoles yep. in my closet. I have an Atari. And I just it. have them because sometimes it's like, yeah, I want to play Guitar Hero on mm -hmm. the 360. Right. If that's where it lives. Um, it would be devastating to me on a personal level if I like went and put everything together after I had it. Imagine somebody who didn't he listen to this show. <laughs> right. Goes. You mean the fools now, who aren't listening to the show? Going in, plug in your old machine. You're like, man, I can't wait to go play. Cyberpunk. <laughs> 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 We're drinking and, the Jackie Wells, baby. And it, it won't boot. It just won't work. And you're like, what the fuck? I think that type of thing should be borderline legal, where you have a hard copy of a game and it doesn't work. And in fact, it probably is. So there'll probably be a clash action lawsuit. They'll have to fix it. Hopefully. Or let's give like, or let's give you five bucks, everyone, because the lawyers will make up. That's planned obsolescence, though. Like yep. that is a thing that they. That's knew an when Apple the tactic. By the way, Jen followed you on uh, Twitch. Thanks, Jen. For I'm his on, Thursday I stream night like streams. once a week, usually. Except for last week where games. I didn't because I was fucking exhausted. Yeah, you didn't. Yeah. I think it's like the Apple strategy where they have planned obsolete, uh, so they make you buy the new console, but it kind of it, it defeats the purpose. But then who's all the old the shit games. you bought is gone. But it's not even that. It's the whole fucking point of it all is... If you're going to play games, you're not going to be like, I'll just play the PlayStation 4. Everyone wants the next console. If you're going to play a game, you're going to want the next console. It's mm -hmm. a it's a fact. Yeah. So it seemed like an unne it's not like a phone where like I'll just use the same phone forever. You don't want to play the, the same old, game old on games. The new phone. You want to play all the old games cuz it's not yeah, exactly. You can't go on the old phone or the new phone. You can't so put those fucking Blu-rays <laughs> in a PlayStation 5 and make them work, I don't think. No, the Blu-rays do work for the if you buy the Blu-ray version of the PS5, I thought. For PlayStation 3 games? Like Metal oh, Gear Solid? Oh, 3. Yeah, 3 doesn't work. Yeah, yeah that's where yeah. the whole thing falls fucking apart for me. Yeah, so I'm saying for consoles, it doesn't make sense because of the old, the new consoles, the old games don't work. It's not like a phone. So to make a planned ops thing like that, it just... It's, it's just dumb. It's unnecessary, and it's not like it's going to stop people from or encourage people to buy the new console. People are going to buy the new console regardless because of the new games are there. This only hurts people who are going to want to play the old games. And that's fucked. And fuck you for doing it, Sony. Fuck you, you piece of fucking shit. Cocksuckers. I'm, no, I'm, I'm mad. I'm mad about this in the same way that I'm mad that Nintendo like resells you old nes games at five dollars a pop like yeah a little cheap i have a closet i have a closet full of these things I do too. <laughs> why does this mean nothing but i'll pay i'll pay the five dollars for the convenience of playing on the switch for those yeah, times i don't want to do it but i'll still there i'll still collect it too i have i have a fucking drawer full of snes games i got like 60 snes games probably a good 40 nes games all the good shit obviously sega too like i got all that shit yeah. No, the PlayStation 3, though, that's the one where it gets weird for me. Because, like, all the old shit, there's easy ways to emulate that. Well, I don't like, care about figure, the, DL, the downloadable games. Like, honestly, I don't give a shit about those Well, games. some people, the only version that they had was the downloaded version. Well, you know buy I mean? a fucking physical copy for $4 right now. Yeah, yeah. well, as long as you can. Yeah, but, like, right. especially with the weird shit like the PlayStation 3 or even the Wii U, if we want to get real technical. Where like those games aren't gonna be able to come be able to come over to new shit and be played the same way anymore. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Like, well, I, th I think it's a it's a huge loss but, to be. But that's like, the thing about no, downloadable too is I always was a shot. Another shot. Holy fuck, you're gonna kill me, but it's great. The thing about uh, let me get my topic in, then I'll raise my drink. Uh, the thing, the thing that is when like, even for computer games. I always mm -hmm. bought a physical copy for that very fucking reason. The servers will go down. I won't be able to play the game. And that worked out great for me, with the exception of if that CMOS fucking battery goes out. <laughs> then, then it's like <laughs> kind of shit. That's fucked, right? <laughs> yeah. That, so I got to replace the battery before the servers go down so it can sync. And I'll get and another 10 years out of it. Hope somebody does a cool hack where you can like hot they swap will. that thing. People will always give a cool hack. Well, no, I just do it before, before the servers go down so it resyncs itself once. Yeah, then I have another 15 few fucking few years, years yeah. and hope someone can let me hot swap it. But then again, that's, that's, what so they did with the that's saves such on, unnecessary. Like, cards. I know. And Game Boy. Game Boy is notorious. Like any Game Boy Advance or Game Boy Color game, you're pretty fucked right yeah. now. They came with those like Phoenix Got kits or whatever. Get your shot through. But like, yeah, eventually somebody will come up with one. As long as you did it before the battery is dead, you'll be able to preserve it. But... Right. Ugh. It's shit. Let's get to Fucking let's go to Sony. let's go to Long Dong and then figure out what we're playing for singing or ghost hunting or whatever. I do on. like singing, but I don't want to force you to sing. I got like an hour. This and is and the half only time that this is the only time I ever sing. That's fine. Let me turn <laughs> off the music. So we'll do some we'll do some singing. I I don't have any songs lined up either, so it's great. So. I'm going to mute the audio for this bit so it doesn't save it in the VOD, so then I don't get fucking copy striked. Yeah, you know what? Do so Long this Dong is Long Dongs. Uh, does uh, Cheese Man want to. Oh, Tom already, he already did. Tom's company, TTSA, releases the video first. Uh, oh, I got to show the video? You just let me know when I can unmute the stream so I can enjoy and get mad. We're going to have to leave the Tom Long Dog segment here. Let's go back to the room. I got to show. Spot. Good. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I gotta, I gotta showcase this. All right, all right, all right. So mute, mute me, man. Mute me, man. Okay. All right. This is what Cheese Man wanted to show. Mm-hmm. There's a dot on the center there, moving around. That is so high that says cannot maintain track. No. That was it? I'm fucking pissed. <laughs> <laughs> we saw a dot. Okay. This could come up in the news, though. I almost actually did a, a news segment on this, or put it in that thing, because people were putting out like, hey, there was a dot. 